What's poppin' people? How y'all doing today? We are back for another live stream. Sorry I've been on hiatus for the past couple of days, but uh, we're just chilling today. Uh, I might take viewer matches later uh, for the time being. We're gonna talk pre-release. I'm gonna organize some cards. I'm emptying my backpack. It's been a bit. I haven't been necessarily home for the most part, so that's why everything's kind of messy. But Edward is here. What's up, Edward? How you doing, bro? We just chilling today, chilling and talking. We might be playing a couple of games. Um, other than that, we're just kind of relaxing. Kyle was popping. Kyle, dude, Joe Bob. Do you guys see that Joe Bob subscribed? Apparently, sometime recently. Let's chill and stream, peeps. Let's talk about pre-release and stuff. Uh, I'm the first one here, dude. You are the first one. Dude, first. Did I misspell pre release? I don't think I did. Um, have you S? I don't know what you're saying. Let's go ahead and tell people that I am here, that I am live. Also, thank you for dropping a like. Appreciate it. To the Discord peeps. Live and chillin'. Always oh, gonna. There we go. Let's go to announcements. Boom, 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 boogity, boogity, boom. All right, what's popping, everybody? I think we are good. I think that's everything that we need to do. <coughs> so how did, how did y'all pre-release go? Tell me now. Have you guys? If you guys went to one, how did it go? If you guys didn't go to one, what card are you looking the most forward to pulling in this set? And are you planning on getting any boxes, or are you just going to get like random packs here and there? How's that going to go for you? I'm, I'm interested. What's up, Blake? He looks like mine went awful. I'm sorry to hear, bro. How'd you do? Only bulk? You didn't? Oh, dude. So I went to, uh, let's see. I went to two, and I got three boxes. One for me, and then I went to, me and Joseph went to one today. Um, and I paid for his, so it's like my box. And in my in the box I paid for that was mine five green codes, absolutely atrocious. It was sad, but I won the tournament, so I got seven extra packs. It was still pretty bad. I live in Minnesota, so my pre-release is in, is in the 28th of July. Oh yeah, there's multiple places that have multiple releases. I know we have more next weekend. I'm probably not going to go to them, but they exist. <clears throat> my pre-release has been pretty solid though for the most part. Like. Like the initial packs were bad, but the winning packs were great. Cause I went 3-0 in this one, and then like in my in those packs, I got some good stuff. I got some good stuff. We got a bunch of codes here too to open once uh, the set comes out. But hey guys, go ahead and like the stream if you haven't already. Drop a like, subscribe, share all that good jazz. We're gonna probably take some viewer matches here in a second. Right now, I'm just trying to put everything out that I need so that I can start organizing and stuff. Like um. I wanted to see if I could have space in a binder to uh, put this full set in. It doesn't look like it's going to be the case though. I am, this binder is full, so a binder could probably only hold about two sets. Good to know, good to know. Um, which means I need a new binder if I'm going to hold this set in it. Uh, I didn't go to one. Also, I'm hoping the stream doesn't stutter today. Yeah, we're all hoping that, bro. Did I just, what, the hell, what just happened? Um, give me one second, guys. It's odd. But we're good, whatever, doesn't matter. I'm, I might try to find some near me soon. That's good. Hope for the best, Blake, for you. Everyone got three packs afterwards and only bulk from that. Yo, what's up, getting ghastly? Long time no see. Burning Shadow pre release box, by far best looking pre release box ever. Dude, facts. I got two of them. I gave away the other one. My cousin just came back from Japan. He got some packs and me and him opened the packs. I got Charizard Rainbow Rare and Oho OGX, bro. Sell those. Or at least sell the Rainbow Rare, bro. Make yourself some cash. Some cash money. Because that is, that is dope. Do I have an extra binder for this stuff? Not really. Mm, that means I have to get another binder, which is something I don't want to do. But I want to have a master set of all Sun Moon sets. 
I can make it one this weekend. I will next weekend. Hey, good luck though. Good luck. Good luck. Good luck. Good luck. Not even a hollow other than that though. I got, got to a pre-release today myself. Only good thing I got was a super scoop of secret rare again. Ghastly. Let's talk lately. Later, we'll, we'll work a trade for that. If you want, if you if you're down to trade that, because I'm trying to pull four of those myself. <laughs> Just letting you know. If you want to talk later, we can talk. Um. Not selling them. You should sell them. That's money, bro. That's so much money. What are you gonna do with Japanese cards? You're not gonna play them. They're just gonna be pretty to look at. But they're worth a lot of money. Like my goal right now in this set is to pull a Rainbow Rare Charizard and then sell the rest of my booster boxes so that I can buy the rest of the cards individually. Cause I'll save money that way. But the Rainbow Rare Charizard is gonna be worth so much. Are you doing any deck building today? I am at some point. Right now I'm just trying to organize myself, my stuff together. Because I want to have a binder to put my master set of uh, Burning Shadows in when I start it. And that's 169 pages, but the last like 20 cards I'm gonna put in a separate binder. So I only need like a 150 pages binder. I'm trying to see if I have an extra one laying around anywhere. It doesn't look like it. Nah, I don't wanna get another binder because I don't have the money for that. Which means I might have to empty one of these binders or like Transfer all the goods into a different binder. <laughs> but I have every ultra rare in XY in this binder. And that's the binder. I want to keep that binder for that. I have another thing that's like every XY promo almost. With like extra stuff in it. Uh, I don't have enough pages because there's like a million XY promos for some reason. So I can't put it in this binder either. Or I'd love. I'd love to, even though I'm moving to Austin on Friday, so we'd have to figure something out this Wednesday. All right, let's, let's figure it out. You can always PM me on Twitter if there's anything in specific you're looking for. Let me know. But you're moving to Austin? Are you leaving us? That's so sad. Go about to finish my Ninetales GX deck. Oh, you want to see you want to see my Ninetales GX deck? I can show you my list right now. And I can show you kind of what I want to do for post-rotation, if you want to check that out. Or right, we have to play Waylord EX before it rotates. Do you want to? I don't mind, actually. Let me make a notepad of everything that we want to do today. So I don't forget. Um, play Waylord EX for lulls. Um, let me take a look here. Or oh, Charizard GX Rainbow Rare moves Master Ender. This moves all Master Set Collector wallets pretty much. Uh, let's go to Nine Tails. I'm actually trying to figure out what I want to do for post rotation. Is this Nine Tails Auxiliary Post? Yeah, I think it is. Um, no, this isn't Post. What is this? What makes this different than the other one? I actually don't know. I'm so sorry, Dad got a new good job, so we're taking a chance. That's uh, it's sad, but congrats at the same time, you know? Like, I hope for the best for you and your family. Okay, I think this is the updated version. It is gonna be rough. We're gonna. We, you will be missed for sure. Yes. Me, I, no. This one has puzzle of time. No, this is not the updated version. This is the version I don't like. Um, we'll do this. Wonder what, what did I put in this version? I put the new nine tails. Wonder if I can throw those in yet. I can show not owned. Will it be there? I don't think it'll be here. Yeah, it won't be here. Uh, the new nine tails. I guess I'll just put a safeguard Pokemon as a substitute. The new Ninetales is in there, and the, all the other Pokemon are the same. Oh, there's also a Tapu Fini. So I guess we can put use Lapras as a Tapu Fini. I'm, I'm, I'm gonna test out Tapu Fini, because in theory, Tapu Fini plus uh, Ice Blade hits 170. In theory, right? So maybe that's worth trying out. Drop all these. Drop these. I'm playing two Guzma for sure. I'm, I'm up the Mallow count to one. I uh, did the two, I mean, and I upped the field blower count to two. I took out the escape rope, I think. I think I took out the escape rope. I know there's a, f there's still a rescue stretcher in the deck, though. Um, I, I have the deck in front of me. I can actually pull it out, my IRL version. Let me do that real quick. So I don't know the, all the changes I made. DG Gamer later also gets scoop up. Oh, you mean Super Scoop Up for uh, the regular Waylord, non-GX, for post? That's pretty exciting, right? 
Forgiven GG. Nice to see you, bro. Right now, I'm trading Dark High Rainbow Rare Japan card and Muck GX. A hey, dope. What's up, Tricky Mud Gibbs? Thank you, man. I'll miss you too. You're a super fun dude to be around. No, I blush. <laughs> I can't hear audio. Okay, you should be able to hear audio. Yeah. What's up, Timmy? Gyro Physics. Today we're just talking about pre-release stuff. I am. Uh, somebody wanted to see my uh, my post-rotation Nine Tails deck, and I'm kind of giving them an idea of what I'm playing. Now the new Nine Tails theme deck when it comes out. Yeah, it's gonna be dope. Still didn't work. Audio is working for everybody else. So tricky. That's gonna be 100% on your end. I'm sorry. Yeah. Gotta go see you later, Kyle. Uh, let me take a look at my Iron Rock deck that I have. I got the one Bridget, and I got the 2-2 two -two line of Octillery. Everything else is like 4 DCE, 4 Ultra Ball. I think there's two, 3 Guzma in the deck right now. Let me take a look. There's definitely an Ace Roll in the deck, so I should probably put an AZ as a substitute. Let me see how many Guzma are in the deck. I think two was all I needed, just because of my sec first attack. Um, let me take a look here. And there's one Acer roll, so let me put an AZ as a substitute. I clicked another video and the audio was fine. I, I don't, I, I don't literally do not know what to tell you. Like, I, I can't help you in this situation because <laughs> I don't know. Like, if it's working for everybody else, then I, 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 it's something's wrong on your end, not my end. Um, let's do expanded as well. There you go. I think I need to up the A's of roll account to two. I'm not too sure. Let me take a look at my deck again. It's somewhere. Um, you can, you need a thicker support line. Yeah, I know. I'm just working around it. Oh yeah. Uh, wait a minute. I know I play four Sycamore, but I only play three N because I believe in Octillery decks you only need three N. Um, at least that's something I'm trying lately and it's been working out very well. Not to mention I only have three full arts, I don't want to get a fourth one. I still play escape rope, although I'm not too sure how necessary escape rope is. I think I'd rather play a third Guzma, to be honest. I have my three choice bands still. Everything else looks right. Oh, I also play a special charge now, but I don't know if I like it. Like, after playing it, I'm gonna put it in for now. But it's the one card that I'm debating because people keep telling me play special charge, play special charge, but then I never really use special charge. So like it's still up in the air for me whether I want to use it or not. But I do play a one of right now. And I think I'm gonna play another Ace Rolla because Ace Roll is really good in this deck actually. So um I think this is my post-rotation decklist for the time being. Until it, like, it needs testing because I haven't actually tested it too much. I tested it in the Greninja matchup and it works great in the Greninja matchup. What's up, Nebs? I'm going to go on Wednesday and whatever I get, I'm going to trade for Galispod. You have a pre-release on Wednesday, Gyro Physics? Dope. Yeah, I need a couple of Galispods myself. I really like the Galispod deck. I like how Hita looks thicker with two C's. Sends you a DM, I do dope. Don't know the problem here, I'm done here. I hate you, Swampert. What main deck are you gonna use for Burning Shadows? I don't know, it's a toss up. I really like Spot, I really like Gardevoir, and I really like Ninetales still. So, and then Greninja's always one of my decks that I like if I really wanna win. To be the only real cards I want, I think Eevee did or Pikachu. Uh, okay, um, I'll be sure to look at cards later, today and tomorrow, uh, Gang Ghastly. I'll see what I can find. If you're looking for Gengars, I have a couple hollow ones somewhere, so I'll have to look, I'll have to dig for those, but I can give you, like, whatever you need. All those cards, I'm pretty sure I can get you. Um, you didn't put stream and uploads? I don't put stream and uploads, because they're not technically uploads, they're live streams. They're uploads later, but I put them in announcements. Isn't, isn't he doing fan belt? I was going to do my tough case. Yes, we'll, we'll do some fan matches here in a second. Tricky Mudkip. Should I pick Glispot or Guardi after rotation? You could honestly play them both. They're both really good. You think Norbin will be good just like Seismic Sword? I'm going to officially try the deck uh, sometime this week. Like, I'm thinking I'm playing Noivern versus a Tapu Koko video here soon uh, as a live matchup, and I'm going to see how it works. Ah, Noivern I'm still, like, in the air about because it takes so long to... To charge up without double dragon 
Is Karmic needed? No, Karmic is a substitute for the Ninetales. If I had a different art Ninetales, I'd probably put that instead. Do I have a different art Ninetales? Oh, I do have a full art. Let me use that instead. Um, the Ninetales is a substitute for the Aurora Veil Ninetales that just came out. So this is what the line would be. This would be one Aurora Veil, three regular arts. No, or I have no money, so I need to choose one. I can't afford both. I'm just saying, uh, no, what I'm not saying go get both, but uh, I'm saying, I'm saying uh, you could choose either or, and you'd be good because they both have their faults, and they're both really good decks. Like Glisspot is good. It doesn't need abilities, so Greninja's Greninja's a good matchup. It also hits for huge numbers. It can beat anything if you have a really good setup. But a uh, Gardevoir is the same way. Yeah, I was doing the Greninja versus Gardevoir matchup, and it's so 50-50 that like it's fine. And uh, Greninja, uh, Garbodor, or Gardevoir really only loses to like Volcanion and like, Metagross, but I haven't really tested the Volcanion matchup too much yet because I know you can work around it if you play well. Since I sent a waifu over, since I won waifu over Glissbot. Alright, good luck, man. You got, I'm absolutely tired of all these abominable puns. <laughs> I don't know, do you, do you, do you know how good the Sidewai Plume is right now? It's pretty broken, dude bad and then we lose via seeker i mean plume is rotating so that doesn't really matter what was i doing though um i was getting my stuff for a master set together which i don't think i can do so because uh, i don't have a free binder right now i think Although, I do have this binder full of playable cards and collection stuff. I think I'll just keep this as it is. So I'm probably never gonna I'll put this to the side. Uh, so I have this black binder that has my master, my, my ultra rares, my all of my legal XY ultra rares and legal sun moon rares, which I guess is all of them. So that I don't use in my decks in general, so I can always pull them out when I need them, and they're always in a safe place. So this is here. Um, I need to make more space in this binder too. I have plenty of space to make, it's okay though. I'll be alright. This will be put to the side for now. And then this one has Sun Moon Base and Guardians Rising. So I think all I could do right now is get a new binder. That's unfortunate. Ah, uh, it's so much money I don't want to spend. Oh well, I'll just work on getting a new binder tomorrow. Um, Okay, got it. you can change decks. Can. Or I'm saying item luck isn't busted anymore, especially when it's guaranteed not to be tier one. Oh yeah, no, I'm not saying it's busted, but I still think it's gonna be a good deck. Like the numbers are really nice in that deck. And then between Super Scoop Up and Acerola, and you're item locking your opponent, it'll be fine. Like that, you you you'll barely you'll barely ever knock out your opponent will barely ever knock you out, and you're just doing spread damage the whole time. Like I think it's a good deck. So I'm not too worried about it. But I just don't think it's gonna be like a amazing deck that's what i'm saying all right so uh no actually i want to save this let me do guardian or er, that's fine that's fine that's fine um nine tails artillery so i'm just gonna put post i have to i can't whatever post nine tails locked we'll do that so i can take a look at it later all right let me look at greninja because i do want to work on building a post rotation greninja deck Um, this Pokemon line stays the same. These turn into Ultra Balls and Timer Balls because that's all you can really play. Let's do. Got our four Ultra Balls. Let's play two Timer Balls. I like. Uh, I really want to play four of those after testing it. I really like four. We lose these. I want to play another one of the Fishermen, we lose Hex. I think I want to play more Guzma, so I'll make it a three Guzma line, and we'll make this a four four line. Four choice bands is good. I want to up the water count by one. What else is there that I'm missing? I'll take a look in a second. Oh, wait a minute. The Guzma replacement, because I wanted to play this actually on PTCGO when I got a chance. So what I'm going to do on PTCGO, post rotation, funny enough, Pokemon Catcher. <laughs> <laughs> as the Guzma replacement. Just for the time being, you know? 
I don't like Starmie and Greninja. I don't think it's good. Gotta love that Splatoon music. Yeah, it's just chilling in the background. Yep, yeah, what if it destroys that pre-release? Dude, you wanna know what beats pre-release? I went 3-0. I just played Quad Radicate. Quad Radicate with a 2-2 lineup Corbominable. That was my deck. It was wild. I made a dude deck out from Beware. It was so satisfying. Nice. Play Politoed. Oh, remember to read chapter 6? I'm gonna do that later. What card other than Charger GX do you do you think will be expensive? I think all the supporters are gonna be worth a good amount of money, but I don't think like expensive is like hundreds, like like over fifty dollars or actually over thirty dollars is expensive to me. And that's what it sounds like for a Charger. Charger's gonna be worth like eighty, hundred, something something like that. Um let me take a look at let me take a look at Greninja as well since I'm here. You know who's not here? Because I'm surprised isn't here? Patrick. Somebody tell Patrick to come by. Also, how do you think Alone Radicate will do competitively? I think it'll be fun. I don't think it'll be great. I think if we, I think after testing, if I feel like we have a good chance of streamlining cards in general, it might be worth trying. Because like just between, um, you play a 4-4 Lion, Rescue Stretchers, um, Muscle Dumbbells and Choice Bands, because you're gonna have 160 HP, which is a lot of HP, and just Ultra Balls and Timer Balls, I think that that could be a lot of fun. Hitting for 60 every turn, you have to play a bunch of Guzmas, uh, even Acerolas to put them back into your hand. Super, no, not Acerola, super, super, super up. And even Acerola if you can fit them. I think it'll be a lot of fun to play. It's definitely going to be one of the one of the decks I play uh, competitively on the channel at some point. Like after I get all the big decks out of the way. Let's put this Grimer away. Uh, how many Grimers do I have? Where's my Grimer spot anyways? This is Sun and Moon, right? No, this is Guardians Rising Hall. I'm looking at the wrong thing. Sun and Moon base. I'm just putting cards away right now, guys. So give me one second. Okay, right, cool. These are my Grimers. Put those Grimers away. I'm never going to use them anyways. Um, Alright, so I'm, that's good to put that binder away. Is buying a Lele Rainbow Rare worth it? I mean, if you have the money for it. Like right now, I want to get a third one. But I, I'm super duper broke. Like, if I could, I get a third one, like, in a heartbeat. But that's just me. That's because I like playing maximum rarity. That's all. Um, otherwise, I would just get like two regular arts. Just because you know it's it doesn't change the game at all for you. I think you have a lot of disruption with a Lolan Radicate. Disruption and Radicate that could be good too. I think it's pretty solid to be honest. Uh, we can throw in a Max Potion, but I'm not sure if I like Max Potion and Greninja. Like, after trying it, like, I've never really gotten a successful chance to use it. And since you have to play low counts anyways, I'm not too sure how much I like it. Um, I think the deck is fine the way it is on, on the, right now. Yeah, I like the way it is right now. Also, wish Wobbuffet's attack was only two second energy. Same, but I mean, you can Max Luxor and uh, Wish Baton with Wobbuffet, which is really, really handy. I think you have a lot of them. Super 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 Rare might be a pretty cool. I hear it's going to be good in that in that up and coming list, but like, I need to have me four of those secrets because I'm thinking about Maximum Rarity Galissapod to be honest. But I want I just want four Super Scoop Up Rainbow Rares. That's like the that's like the one card I want a four of. But th this set's annoying because I want three Acerolas, three Guzmas, three Choice Bands, and four Scoop Ups. So it's going to be expensive and hard for me to pull this off. I'm always here, dude. I just say quiet. I just say quiet because the mods here talk a lot about weird stuff. That's funny. What's up, UK English, bro? Did you pull anything good at pre-release? Well, I pulled a secret rare fire energy, a Gardevoir full art, a Slazzle regular art. I think that's it. I think I pulled. No, no, I pulled. I pulled Charizard regular art and uh, Rainbow rare Lycanroc. Rock. But I got like a bunch of packs. I got seven for winning. Um, plus five for the first one, then another six. So that's seven, five, that's 12, six makes it 18, and then I got another seven from my first pre-release, so that's 25. So out of 25 packs, that's what I got. So I think it was pretty decent. I like the pull rates in this set, they, they seem pretty decent. I'm triggered because my booster box is late arriving. Yeah, I, I saw that, Nebby, I'm sorry, man. Or how many packs battles do you have left in what sets? I think two more pack battles left, and if I win the next couple, I make it to pre-release. And they're gonna be the evolutions in Steam Siege, so they're not interesting. BRB, don't say anything important while I'm gone. <laughs> I pulled a Darker and Charizard in one pre-release. The Mud, oh nice, the Mud Kid Gaming Nation, that's my boy. Shout out to you guys. By the way, guys, don't forget to drop a like if you haven't already. 
it is always greatly appreciated. I'm trying to think of what I need right now. Okay, I think I just ha I think I have to bite the bullet and just get a new binder tomorrow. So I think that's what I'm gonna do. Uh, that means I'm gonna have like eight binders. I need a box for all these binders, bro. I'm definitely relaxing on the playset though. Like, I, I'm not gonna do the uh, full like four reverse hollows like I did originally, just because like the money's kind of tight right now. So I'm just going to do like I'm gonna get four of each card, but like only one of them is gonna be reverse. I think that's gonna be the new thing I'm going for today. Or make your Steam Siege competitive pick Baby Volk for me. That's gonna be hard though, cause like that's a rare, and I could get more points by not doing that. I don't know. We'll see. If I have a really good chance of making it to uh, finals, I might do that. Oh my god, Mudkip Gaming Nation. The Kips are attacking. Boy, don't get a binder, just tap the cards onto your wall out of sleeve. That's a good idea. I just got an early train box and pulled nothing. Oh, I'm sorry, but it was all Bloodlust. I like it. I like the username. When Ori switches to Twitch, I'll change my name from Nebby Worst Mod to Nebby Not Mod. <laughs> That'd be awkward whenever you are a mod, don't you think? You get more points when you pick a rare from your competitive pick. Yeah, but I get zero points if I don't get the cards, right? I might do it. We'll see. We'll see. Um, hey, what are you doing for fan battles? Oh, we can just... I want to do something. Like, uh, I need to figure out what Dennis and other streamers do to make, like, a point system and stuff like that. Because I want to start getting into that. But we'll see. We'll see. Um, risk or you got to take risk. We'll see. We'll see. We will see. Let me get some fan matches here in a second as well. Let me save this as a post post for ninja. I still need to rematch you with my Tokyo CX deck. My feelings. Um Sup King Gasly. I'll get a game. Before between, between like organizing and stuff, I'll get a game, sure. Why not, right? Let me just look around. Yeah, you know what, we'll just get a game. Um, tricky Mudkip. I don't usually do this, and I'm probably never going to do this again, but you can challenge me. I don't usually pick viewers to challenge, but I know you've been patiently waiting these past couple of days, and I've battled most of the people on this channel already. You missed something very important. Why Pokemon Catcher? It's because it's troll. It's because it's a post-rotation deck, right? And I don't have Guzmas, and I don't want to play. And I don't want to play Lysander. <laughs> I, it's they're supposed to be Guzmas whenever a rotation actually happens, but obviously I don't have them right now. Can we have a friendly battle? So for the most part, so what I'm going to be doing is uh, after this after this match with Tricky, I'm going to be doing um, joint. I'm going to be doing go, and that's whenever you challenge me. And I will accept the first challenge that isn't a repeat challenge. Or what did I miss? He didn't miss anything. They're just trolling you. At least I don't think you did. I don't think I said anything important. The audio died out, so I didn't hear anything for the last five seconds. Tr tricky. Challenge me. Oh, there we go. Okay, you're good. He's, she's playing Tokyo, so I don't want to play a Greninja, because I don't want to be that guy. I want to play something that I might lose. This looks like I might lose. <laughs> the audio the, there we go all right we'll get this one game tricky and then after that i'm gonna do some more organizing and then i might get another game with another viewer well i mean i will but like it's not gonna be like right away or anything play quad helioptile you keep saying to play these decks but i'm not gonna build them if you want them to be built send them my way oh this is a bad start oh well for some reason, mobile isn't letting me have peeps. That's weird. Coco Teaser is amazing, dude. It's fun. I don't, I don't want to call it amazing because it's kind of like inconsistent. What's going on? What happened? Where's my... Oh, my chat. Oh, why was that? What just happened? Oh, Nico Nico. How much did you... <gasps> Bro, did you just donate $15? Bro? 
bro. Hold on, let me let me finish his turn and then hold on, bro. Bro. I need you to relax, man. Hold on. I gotta I gotta let me go to Streamlabs real quick to confirm this. Cause it's kinda it's kinda small on my computer. But uh I think I, I think I see what he just did. Hey, I'm in Streamlabs. Can I can I sign in? Is that a thing I can do? Okay, come on, computer. I need you to work with me here, please, because I'm in the middle of doing a lot of things. Uh, log in. Let's grab a Coco. Welcome. Please log in below. I don't understand what you're doing. It's my name as Orgom. Allow. Okay, there we go. Let's do this. Sycamore. Oh, if I got a float zone here, that would have been magical. It would have been a magical turn. Let's go ahead and energy drive here. Uh, oh my god, he actually donated $15. My donations. Did he leave a message? I want to make sure he didn't leave a message. Thank you for being a wonderful streamer. I love you. No homo. Oh my god, Nico. First of all, First things first, because he donated $15, he actually he actually um, gives himself 15 points to win a Lele at the end of this month. So, uh, on on my on, because right now for every dollar you donate to me, whether it's through super chat or through uh, or through um, what's it called or through uh, donations, for every dollar is another entry, and at the end of the month we put in all your entries and we pick a random winner for the for the giveaway that month. So next this upcoming month. It's going to be both um, the Lele for this for this month, and then for last month on threes, I'm going to choose another winner for Shaman because I bring the luck hasn't been around to take his prize. Dude, thank you so much, Nico. My boy, thank you so much. You're amazing. Is it my turn? It's my turn. I should probably make my plays, huh? Blue Water Pokey Brett one two three join the Aura Army. Hey, welcome to the Aura Army, my boy. I think we play. Oh, I want an Ultra Ball. Cause I want to attach it. Mm, this is a tough play. I think I'm just gonna. I think I'm just playing whatever. Cause I wanted to attach a DCE here, so I and I also want to put energies in the discard pile. From uh, I don't know. There's too many things going on at once right now. It's super exciting. Can we like? Can we like? You know, like relax. <laughs> oh my god, this is so annoying. All right, let's do this. Do I want to do that actually? How much? What is this? Buffalon. Oh, this is, I didn't know this was an, ex, this is a, like, dude, you gotta tell me that it's a standard or expanded deck, bro. Do me that next time. Do me that favor next time. And damage and is reduced by 20. So, I guess the better play is to attach here. For the time being, at least. We'll see, I'm just gonna take things slow in this matchup. Anyways, back to the chat that I missed. I missed a lot of things. Play quad he's up top, okay, or the yada yada yada. Oh, PG job burning shadows the same day as it comes out. Yep. How do you send a deck list for you to try? There is the Discord, which I can update the link. I don't know if it's I don't know if the link is still there. Uh, let me double check. But if not, I'm gonna update the link. There's a link in the description um, for the Discord. How do I invite people? Here it is, invite people. Copy. Uh, that you can join and there's a deck list chat where you can just uh, put in a deck list. You can also DM me on Twitter and stuff. Like, there's ways. There's multiple ways to do it. Um, as long as you send me the deck list, we can just import it. But try to send me an import as well, and not just like a written down deck list, because that's not easy for me to deal with. All right, that should be updated there in a couple of seconds. Uh, we'll put down another Coco. I can't Mega Evolve. I think I just play down Shaman this turn because this is unfortunate. He has a full bench that I want to damage so bad. We play the Shaman. Can we, like, stop? That'd be pretty nice. Have to play in again, that sucks. Um, let's do this. Do I want to do that? I do want to do that, I don't have a play, otherwise. Let's grab... nothing. Mega Turbo. And we play N. We might get another attachment this turn. Let me take a look at this. Thirty-three dollars? 
What? Bro, you need to stop. Like, that is the most anyone is. Oh, somebody tell Patrick he lost his throne. He is, this is actually the most anyone is donating. Actually, that's not true. I think Patrick has donated over $50 now. But that's still wild, bro. Like, thank you so much. Thank you so, so much. You are really, really supporting the dream. You're supporting the Aura Army right now. Like, wow. Dude. <laughs> thank you. Thank you. God. That's amazing. That's amazing. That's another 33 entries. <laughs> so hold on, what's 33 plus 15? That is uh, 30 plus 5, 15 is 45. That's 48 entries. <laughs> oh my god, that's wild. That's wild. Oh my god. Or is one of on new bodies or tape to tape on sleep cards on the wall? <laughs> I hate you. Joseph's here, thank god. What's up, Joseph? Um, Blue Water Pokey Brett is here. What's up, bro? Great intro song, thank you. Welcome, Brett. No notification squad. Wait, are we doing sub matches? We're kind of just messing around right now. Like, I'm, I'm organizing my cards while taking viewer matches. So, like, it's, it's not the most consistent thing ever. But we chillin'. We chillin', straight up. Can I get a... Thing that would help me. I wanted to play Coco. I don't think it's gonna be happening this turn though. Cause I grab Seeker, play in again. Oh, I could play Sycamore this turn instead, which is probably better. Where's Sycamore? Yeah, there it is. We can pack battle you soon with one pack or this is fact. What's going on here? Nebby donated a dollar fifty. I can't donate fifteen, but I'll donate one point five. <laughs> you guys are wilding right now. Thank you guys, all of you are so great right now. Holy crap. I know it's been a while that I, since I streamed, but I didn't know you guys missed me this much. <laughs> Insane. Insane. Let's go into Lele, just do some small damage here. Let me, let me, okay, so Nebby now has one and a half foes. I'm just gonna round that one up, just because I like Nebby. He's, he's, he's pretty cool. Uh, Nebby will have four entries, so edit. Four, save. There we go. Um, back to the chat. Sorry, I'm so behind on the chat, guys. I was doing so many things at once. Can you pack Veto soon? But it's Sunday. <laughs> Special thing for Chicken Book. When I was younger, I framed a Radiant Collection Reshram. Yeah, but it's beautiful. Way over 50. Oh, well, Patrick's here to, to confirm that he has donated over $50 and that his throne is never gone. All right, let me do this real quick before we get back in the stream. Do I attach? I think I do. Would I manually attach a dark energy? Um. And do I want to do this? I don't know if I actually want to do this. Put this here. Do I want a sycamore? Or is it worth? Or do I wait? I mean, I don't have that many cards in my hand. I shouldn't sycamore. Do this, and we'll get our knockout here. Destroy your king. It's because I challenged him with my Toki I took a while ago. I wanted a rematch. This is true. The love live represent. So you can buy Mario Kart now? <laughs> I guess I could, but I'm not going to. Hey, we're glad you can stream again. I talked to Nebby, and now I was up with the memes for the channel, so now maybe I can give you pointless and stupid jokes. Can I write Mr. Ferret? I'm looking forward to it. Wait, Aura, how can I, how can I have a half entry? <laughs> Mr. Friday with the super chat with two dollars. <laughs> Let me add two more entries to my boy. Um, my God, Mr. Friday. Oh, this is Mr. Friday's first entry. No, never mind. It's not his first. Never mind. I see it. Never mind. Edit. That's me hugging you guys. Nico, Nico donated another two to make it an even fifty. Oh my God, you guys are insane. I'm about to say, where's the music? I see the thing, but not the music. There you go, 50 for uh, Nico Nico. All right, Nico, enjoy your Lele when, it, when you get it. <laughs> is it my turn? So I get a knockout here, I think. What is my 11 cards? I'm okay. Oh, wait a minute, I have to retreat, but I don't have a, ooh, how many energies are left in the deck? I actually don't know. There's still, there should be like two more DCEs, right? Let's see if I can find it. It's probably not my best play, but you know, there should be enough DCEs in the deck. 
Apparently, I can't draw them though. Ooh, that's problematic. All right, Lele, do the do. <clears throat> All right, back to the chat. I need money for singles. No, bro, ne like, Patrick, you don't have to donate, bro. I always appreciate the donations. I don't want to pressure anyone to donating. I appreciate it every single time, but like, you don't ever have to donate, ever. I need to draw for the stream again, or should I do trying to refine my dueling skills? Who, what do you guys want to see? What Pokemon related thing do you guys want to see again? Ghastly Doodle, let me know. How does it feel to be going against yourself, Aura? It's very sad. <laughs> that uh, Depoid? What's up, Depoid? Long time no see, dude. Don't, um, Disco Biscuits, what are the entries for? It's for a Lele, where you just a Lele on PCGO. Like, it's it's like the no donations are just people being nice to me, so I figured if people are going to be nice to me by donating, I'm going to be nice to them and like, like give them a chance to win something. Cause I can't give everything, everybody something. I mean, I love water grass, so. If you ever donate every dollar is one entry. Yeah, every one dollar that you donate is another entry to win a to win a thing. I'll be right back taking a shower. Don't end the stream without me. Well, dude, bro, it's probably gonna be a bit before we end the stream. Even though it's oh man, so we've already been streaming for like what almost an hour now. That's kind of wild. Draw a Jangmo. Oh, that'd be kind of do. Como, I love Como and Jangmo. No drawing stuff for y'all. Let me know. I can't put, I can't put double using mighty energy. How do people get mod? Uh, I mean, really everybody's a mod on YouTube. It's just because like if you if you come to a lot of streams and I find you relatively entertaining and responsible and stuff like that, I make you a mod. So if you come to a lot of streams, ferret, you can become a mod as well. Pokemon Conquest stream one day. One day I do want to play it again because it was fun. <clears throat> oh, that sucks that he got so many tails. I'm sorry. Well, there's my DC, so let's go ahead and just... Well, that's not going to work either. I don't mind giving them a knockout, I guess. Let's do this. We'll just energy drive. Playmat update? No updates right now. The guy that I wanted to do the artwork for is literally, like... I am, like, just gone. Like, straight up gone. So, I don't have... I don't have an artist that I want to work with right now. So, I'm looking into getting more artists. Um, that I feel like are decent enough. So... I'll let you guys know on Discord artists that I like, and I'll let you, and you guys can tell me if you also like the artists as well. <clears throat> and then we can go from there. Remind me, are links fine in the chat? They should be. Oh, wow. Okay, yeah. It's not very standard. <laughs> I can still lose this. Actually, no, I have 16 cards in my deck. I'll be okay. Just play cards to get cards out of my hand, I guess. See what's in there. Wow, we have all these energies left and I can't seem to draw them. What is energy drive here? Pokemon Go stream, also have clickbait title and it'll be overjetic. Yeah, I'm not doing that. <laughs> I stopped playing Pokemon Go. Is there something, someone next after this? There can be. Like once again, I'm, I'm doing things little by little right now. Like I'm taking matches, but at the same time I'm uh, I'm kind of like organizing my cards. So after I get this match, we're going to take a small break while I kind of like put everything together and then we're going to take another game. So be sure to like the stream if you haven't already, guys. It's always greatly appreciated. We have 21 viewers here. So be sure to do that. I'm on the Discord, I'll mail. Give me a while for the draw, Jango. All right, man. Uh, Hurricane Wing, get all the heads, every single heads. Come on, all of them. Oh, so close. I was hoping she would get all heads. But that should be game. We just attack with uh, Tarin and Tarfa game. Well played, man. Thank you. Thank you for challenging me. I appreciate it. I'm just, you know, we're just going to attack. It's definitely a knockout. It's going to do a lot of damage. 810 damage. My god. I feel bad. But sorry, Dogekiss. I love you. I do. Over 100% life money. <laughs> Can you add me? My name is Carlos. Add me. Just uh, if you want if you want if you want to add me, just go ahead and do it. Um Oh yeah, there you already did. Never mind. We're good. I'll accept friend request. No worries. Until I hit over 200, then I have to start deleting random people. Actually, speaking of deleting random people, I think I have to play a little bit on the ladder because I want to get more coinage action. Because I think there was something in the shop that I wanted. I couldn't pull my trick coins, I'm sorry. It was a good game regardless. Oh yeah, I wanted this. So I wanted like, just to win a couple of games. I accept matches when I say, when I put go in the chat. If you want to add is Coros 11. What's up, CZ Studio? 
Who's messaging here? Well played, Tricky. Well played. It was fun. It was a lot of fun. Um, well, Ora defeated himself. I feel so bad. I feel so bad. But I want to buy this, so I need a little bit more coins. So we're probably going to grind the ladder in a second. But for the time being, I'm making sure that I have everything set. Um, because I want to start recording more of my stuff. I want to get another game recorded tomorrow. So I'm probably going to try to build Neuvern versus Tapu Koko. Because I should have all the cards I need except for like maybe the Noibats. But I should have some Noibats somewhere. I know I, want, I know I was looking through my cards and found a bunch of the breakthrough ones. The thing is, I don't know where I put them at all. So like I have three breakthrough Noibats just kind of chilling somewhere, but I don't know where. So I'm trying to find those. Because if I want to do these live deck matches, I kind of need those cards. They're not here. They might be in my buddy's house, I just don't know where I would have put them. And then I have to look through cards that Gang Ghastly wants to trade, because I have to get that Secret Rare Super Scoop up. I need to get four of those, <laughs> ideally. Um... And he also work on selling some cards. I think I can... Well, maybe I don't. I have Ace Rollers in here, so I, could, I actually might need to make copies of those or something. Or maybe, like, somebody could let me borrow one for videos. I don't know. Whenever the whenever I'm climbing the ladder, I do good, but now I do trash. Oh, you were super close to the mic, and it was ear rape for over one second? <laughs> I'm sorry. What's up, King Beast Rocky? Actually, speaking of, like, grinding the ladder, I was just remembering that Dark Ride is, like, my deck to play whenever I'm grinding the ladder. So let me actually play some Dark. When everyone just like want to win the game, because Darkrai is like the best deck for me to play because it's super brain dead, and I can do other things while playing it. Updated guard, Umbreon updates, Incineroar, Lapras. Where is my Darkrai deck? You know, all these years of PTCGO, and they still don't have a search option for uh, for like this thing. This is Joy Nine Tails. It's not Dark Tina, is it? Unless I just Hold on, Carlos, I need you to understand you're not, I'm not challenging you, I'm not accepting challenges that way. When I put go in the chat, that's whenever you mess, that's whenever you uh, challenge me. And if you're the first person to get the, to get the challenge, then uh, that's whenever I battle you. I think it was Turbo Dark. You want to trade, f you want me to trade you a full art in generation? In gen, oh, the set generation? I don't need anything from, uh, I don't need anything from these sets right now. The only thing I'm looking for right now is... Uh, burning shadow stuff whenever it comes out. Now my previous, I watched a seven-year-old pull full of Guzma, Hyper Rare Glitz, Blood Secret for Energy, and Hyper Rare Bulu. He didn't even sleep them. Did you tell him? Did you did you sacrifice his soul to the Pokemon gods? Because that's what I would have done. Someone should pass me three Rainbow Rare Guardi. That's how I feel right now, man. I want three Rainbow Rare Ready Guardi or three Rainbow Rare Glitz Spots. <laughs> that's the goal. You kept on playing N when when I got my trick coins. I'm sorry. You. At my pre-release, I watched the uh, Feels Bad Man. And what do I pull? Nothing. That's just how it works, huh? Let's uh, let's do this. Let's do it this way. Are we going first? We are going first. This is actually an amazing hand, then. <clears throat> Same dude. Uh, yeah, I got five green codes from my very first one. Like, I only got pulls because I won the tournament using Eradicate deck. I don't know what to run post-rotation. Um, what are some good options? Uh, I don't. I don't know. This sucks. I think I'm gonna play N. I want to keep my Ultra Balls, and I want him to give. I want him to have less cards. Post rotation. There's uh, there's a couple of there's a couple of options. There's Volcanion. Like I'm gonna I'm gonna name you all the decks off the top of my head that are gonna be good. All right, Volcanion that that are gonna be like really good, not just okay like muck or something like that. Like um, there's Volcanion. There is Tapu Koko, Metagross, uh, Dark decks, Dark Gray. Um, Ninetales, Gardevoir, Galissapod, um, Greninja is going to be really good. There's a bunch of different options. So you have a lot of different deck options to play. I'm glad I can place it of every card in Burning Shadows. Did, I just want to place it of all the, uh, you know, expensive cards so I can sell them. 
Never in my life have I, re have I resorted to top tier in Street Fighter nor in TCGs. I just want to play something that has a chance to win a league. I mean, those all like, they, like that's the cool thing. Like Mr. Friday, I need you to understand right now. Uh, this is this is why I'm super excited for this new format. All those decks that I named are top tier decks. That's a lot of decks that are potentially top tier. It's not like before where we had like maybe two or three decks that are really, really good. And some formats where we have like one deck that's just broken and the other ones are just like good because of that one deck being broken. Like we have an amazing format coming up where there's a bunch of really good decks. So if you like a deck, if a deck is fun to you, then play it. Like there's, there's nothing wrong with playing a deck that you feel is good, that you feel is too good at all because like the format is very diverse. What game is this, Yu-Gi-Oh? I bet Mega Ray with Waylord Vixini. Oh, nice. Can you make a 1-8 KO with one energy? You mean Donk? We have Donk decks, but... I don't know when... I know that Forest got banned and expanded, so like... The Sijuai Donk is no longer good. And like, Donk in general is no good without the Sijuai. Raikou Magazine is top tier. It's broken. <laughs> I'm gonna leak up with Victory Bell as my boy. Can you be my spiritual advisor? I mean, if you ever wanna... If you ever want advice, message me on Discord and I'm there for you, bro. Gotta keep my friends in check, you know what I'm saying? Did he Did he use the attack? Did he, oh, he can't shell drive, never mind. He needs, he needs two energies. Uh, let's do this. These here. These here. Um, put this here. I think I want to knock out these Cyndaquils, to be honest. Mm, let's put it on this, because it's less threatening. So, one, two, three, four. That is doing a decent chunk of damage. I don't like how stuck I am. The dark pulse here. What about Vicable Boo? That's good. I think it's gonna be a little bit less good post rotation, but still, it's still good. Or you should play Magic Duels for stream one day. I probably won't because I don't like that game very much. What's up, Ostrich, bro? Chris, how you doing, bro? And Nathan, how y'all doing? Y'all doing? <laughs> Thank you guys all for showing up. It is also great. It is always greatly appreciated. Alone Muck should make people happy. Alone Muck is a fun deck that I feel like could win a lot of tournaments. So if you want to play a really fun deck that wins tournaments, but isn't like top tier by any means, play Alone Muck. Trying to get into Yu-Gi-Oh. I was considering it, but then like Yu-Gi-Oh is expensive, and I don't want to bother. Like if I don't like, it's hard for me to play a game without getting competitive into it. And that's my fear with like, that's why that's for the most part, that's why I don't play games in general. Because if I get competitive, then I lose time and money and time and money are essential for living. <laughs> I want to make a Gudra deck, but I couldn't make it work. Yeah, Gudra's bad, unfortunately, because I like Gudra's, well, I don't love Gudra's of Pokemon, but I think Gudra's a good Pokemon. But that man is only hit for 80, that's sad, I'm sorry, bro. Uh, let's put this here. The question is, I only hit for 120, right? So I don't knock this thing out yet. And I'm probably gonna be knocked out here very soon. So I have to get prizes if I want a chance of winning. So we'll go ahead and knock out this uh, Turnator. So let's get some two prizes. Hopefully we can get some decent cards here. Moon is good, Dark Energy is not great. We need a top deck like a Supporter or a Lele or an Ultra Ball or something. How did you come into Pokemon? I played Yu-Gi-Oh! And uh, whenever they introduced Pendulums to the game, I played for a little bit longer and like, it just didn't, it was, it's just, Pendulums made the game a lot less fun. It really did, like, <laughs> I didn't want to play Pokemon after that. So I just stopped playing, I stopped playing Yu-Gi-Oh! I mean, and my fiance, my ex-fiance, I should say, we were dating for a bit. This is ridiculous. And, um. Oh, what's this? Hold on. Nebby donating another $5. What did they say? Oh, this is important. Give me one second. Um. Let me refresh this. Nebby, thank you so much for the donation, man. This is getting insane. Five more entries than Friday. Than Friday. One off from 10 and 30 left in my account. <laughs> Nebby. Nebby, thanks so much, man. I really, really do appreciate it. It's Oblivion Wing here. Wow, that is, uh, you guys are so nice. Let me put the five entries into your into your thing, Nebby. Nebby is, edit, now is nine. <laughs> One off from 10. 
There we go. This is going to be a crazy one. There's so many potential winners with Nico and Nico just kind of like overcrowding them all. <laughs> that might be a place in this, in this place in the new format. Gardevoir is good and um, Garbodor is still going to be good. So I think Metagross is going to be great and Metagross now has Necrozma, which is a really, really good attacker. So I think, I think Metagross is better. Team Bad Deck. I like your name, by the way. All the Yu-Gi-Oh players seem to hate the game. That's because Konami just hates hates themselves. <laughs> I'm gonna lose this match. This is gonna be very annoying. Uh, how irritating. What's the retreat cost on this? My stadium is two. I guess no matter what, I can retreat safely. Can I? Can I please not be stuck like this? Like, is that a possibility? more mills so be yes but my my uh, ex fiance she got a she got a couple theme decks from a friend right just non non open theme decks and she, we started playing each other and she really liked the game so this is during the primal clash era right so she wanted to go look at more cards we found out that there was a league right next to our house so we went to uh, that league a lot and uh like we didn't buy cards but like we occasionally just bought a pack for the fun of it and this was during Primal Clash, right? So we weren't like crazy into the game. We didn't know anything about the game for the most part. And um, at some point, like I th it was, oh yeah, we would decide to go to our very first pre-release. This is Ancient Origins pre-release. So we were both really excited about that. Um, I don't know. I want to attach for the turn, whatever. Um, we were both really excited about that. And we did fairly well at that pre-release. I'm not even gonna lie. Like, overall, we didn't do bad at all. Uh, he has had nothing set up, so I think we're good here. And uh, somebody offered her a couple of Growing Skies packs for a card that she pulled. And she was like, sure, I'll give it a try. And she ended up opening up a Shaman, a lot of Shamans. She opened up, like, two Shamans out of them. And um, after we found out that Shaman was an amazing card, we both got really hooked into the game. So then we started investing in the game. Uh, and we broke up, and we are, here we are now. And we'll sit more here. I need to be careful. But yeah, uh, I uh, after we broke up, she uh, she moved away, and we tried to split the cards, but she took most of the cards. But I was like already really invested in the game. I love playing Pokemon, so I just went out of my way and got more cards, and just kept playing. So I think we win this. <laughs> I thought we went from like potentially losing this to actually winning this. Uh, Cool, I'll take it. All Yu-Gi-Oh players seem to hate the game. That's because Konami is a jerk to all of its uh, to all of its fans. I want to try the new Dragon Ball Super TCG because it ends up it, if it ends up not so good, at least it's Dragon Ball. This is dope. That is this is true. I mean, I wouldn't play Muck. I would play Muck, but it's got to the point that people call me Mr. Status Condition. <laughs> That's awesome. I like that name though. The thing about Yu-Gi-Oh is that there aren't staples and they ban cards pretty often. Yeah, it's a very, it's a very quote-unquote balanced game. Uh, I pre like whenever Pendulums existed, it just completely tore the game apart for me. Um, did we get how many coins did we get for that? We got four tickets. Not, not enough coins. Let's get another game. Um, I've spoken to a triple Yu-Gi-Oh player in a long time. I want to, I want better dragon cards. I do, I want the same. I just don't want double dragon energy, but I want dragons that... I wish they would just take away the whole double energy rule that they have for dragons. Volk is going to be everywhere and it's so scary. Yeah, I gotta play those water decks. There's Ninetales, Light, Lapras, and Greninja. Lots of good dragon options. Of course we lead Lele. Why wouldn't we lead Lele? Waterbox is losing popularity, but either I want to play Waterbox or Metagross. Uh, Waterbox, it's just, it's not so much Waterbox lost for popularity, it's just that Waterbox isn't a thing people play anymore. Because, like, Glacial is no longer good. And that was, like, the big thing about Waterbox. But more than that, like, what's the point of playing Waterbox? <laughs> there really isn't one. You can just play straight Lapras or straight Ninetales. Like, there's not a, not, not a lot of tech that's worth playing. He's great, so I have to donate. No, you don't, Patrick. <laughs> I have to donate $100. One sec over. I'm going to break my piggy bank. All right, bro. You, be sure to use a hammer. What pre-release packs weren't recorded? Uh, all of the one that we went to today. The seven that I recorded yesterday, because like my recordings ended up, the audio was really bad, and apparently the seven packs that were important, because 
like we pulled the secret uh, fire energy from the one that I did record, but the audio was really bad, so I don't want to upload it. But the first video was good. That's one where we pulled some other things that we'll talk about later. Um, and then I won the tournament, and I, I thought I recorded my seven pack opening, but apparently it just doesn't exist there, so that's annoying. I was going to say I started this. This is true, Patrick. Thank you so much. Just clearly, the exit choice band is going to be okay. Hit 20. Facts. Magic Card versus Mew. The Kings. Do this. Do this. Do this. And we'll pass because we're stuck. Everyone subscribe. Hey, sell them again, Edwin. Oh, I made a donat donation goal with negative 527 hours left. You actually have to make a new donation goal. Hmm. I should do that. How do I do that? I forgot how I did that. Band, there's banned donors. Apparently, I can ban donators. That's funny. CZ Studio joined the Aura Army. Hey, shout out to you, big dog. Appreciate the support. Thank you for joining the Aura Army. Um, account settings, donation settings. Is that how I do it? Um. That's not how I do it. How do I do this? Did they take it away? I think they took it away. Which is awkward because it's like kind of just chilling there. Um, I should be able to change it, right? Um, donation amount. No, let's go to my donations maybe. How do I... Uh... This is so weird. My sponsors, account settings, uh, donation settings. This is all, I don't understand. Everything's weird and bad. We see if fix this while we, uh, widgets maybe? Donation ticker, is that what it is? Show off your most recent donators. Oh, that thing, yeah, I know what, I know what they're talking about there. Oh my God, why am I stuck? I shouldn't be stuck. This is unfortunate, man. I've been getting stuck a lot. Ugh, this sucks. Goals, here's goals. Donation goal, here we go, found it. All right, so. Let's do, let's, let's, let's fix up this donation goal a bit. I can, you know, open up my thing. Sorry guys, like, there's so many things going on. And I only have one screen to work with because I, I don't have like a big setup. Current goal, let's do, what's a good goal? How, what do I have to pay this upcoming month to help me survive? I have to pay for school. Ugh. We'll, 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 we'll see if I can uh, end donation goal. Alright, so title. Tuition. 400 because I need $400. Goal amount, starting amount is at, z uh, no, starting amount's at $8, how about that? And after, let's do September. January, February, March, April, May, June, July. I think that's nine. Can we, like, not? Ah, oh, how frustrating. Um, let's do this. Dark Pulse. Um... Zero nine, zero one, um, seventeen. Oh, twenty seventeen. My bad. Can't be twenty seventeen. Twenty seventeen. There we go. And we can start the donation goal here. There we go. Dope. So that's set up. Stop hitting me. This man needs to stop hitting me. I'm not, I don't feel good about this. Where are my things and stuff? Is that a knockout? This is not a knockout still. Maybe I should have retreated. Oh well. Oh wait a minute, it is a knockout. Never mind, never mind. I miscounted. We're good. Um, please, something decent. Dark and. Oh, I'm so. This is a frustrating. This is very frustrating. Everyone subscribe. Too bad I, I uh, I'm trying to read these comments. Stop jumping around. There's so much. There's so much in the chat. 
I only picked up Pokemon TG after watching Garbodor Jampa vs. Destroy Ball Boom game on Pokemon YouTube channel recently. The game's actually incredible so far. It's so much fun, right? Well, the Hyper Marshall GX today, pre release. Shout outs to you, Daniel. That's an awesome pull. Salt equals deep fried, fr deep fried fries equals grilled chicken burger. <laughs> I'm joining the Discord. The link won't send. Um, the link should work. You might, you might have to refresh. Oh, we're so behind the chat. This whatever. I'm trying, guys. There's so many things. Amanda, what's poppin', Amanda? What deck you playing? We're playing some Speed Dark, right? Just to like get some coins. I need a couple coins to buy this, to buy the Xerneas thingy. Looks like everyone is looking to play Guardian X format. I know Metagross will stomp, but I have to find trouble finding good decks built for post rotation. No finding a good deck build. I mean, the build that we kind of have right now is good. Just add more Sycamores, more ends, and like I can take a look at it if you if you want me to team bad deck. Let me know. Because I can look at my deck that I have right now and like kind of update it if you would like. You can ban people with donating probably because you can do fake donations on Twitch and probably YouTube. Yes, but luckily, if there's any chargebacks, YouTube now has our back. Or Twitch, uh, but uh, I mean, PayPal has our back now. So what happens now is that if somebody donates and then ch chargebacks, we get to keep the money no matter what. Because that's super not okay to do. So the basic energy, boom. And boom. So now I have to attack with Lele because I'm going to die if I don't. No, I'm going to die regardless, so I'm probably going to lose this game, which is unfortunate. Yeah, I have to attack with this. At least I'm going to get some big damage off. I love the way this promo looks. I have to give myself a couple. And we'll go ahead and energy drive for some decent damage. What's going on here? Nico, Nico D, pay 22. Come on, Nico. you got to stop this. Like, it's, anno it's, it's not that it's annoying. Like, I love it, but it's like, it's it's too nice, you know? Like, I feel bad, but thank you. I appreciate the, I appreciate all the support. Let me see what, let me see what the message said, because I had to log in the stream lab to just see the message. Because that's how things are, apparently. Uh, my donations. Ciao, ciao. Hi, Aura. <laughs> appreciate it, man. Yeah, but that's the cool thing. Of, oh, wow. Is this person going to win? I think they win. I don't think I can win this. Top deck? Well, I mean, that's a top deck if I've ever seen one. Let's get a... Do I get an N? No, I think I have to get six. Oh, but he has such a... Oh, wait. What did I just do? I think I clicked OK. Damn it. I should have got N. I wanted to get N. If I can get a Max Luxor here, that'd be really convenient as well. Like, Max Luxor into Stadium. Nice. If I can land it, that'd be really nice as well. Um, yes, I can. Cool. So that's a knockout. Stadium. And now we have a game, kind of. Like, I still have to get two prizes to win this game. But it's a, it's a possibility, at least. So what I have to do is... Uh, oh, no. He can just... Looks like he can just Lysander for game. That's why I wanted to play N, not Sycamore. Annoying. Um... I made you choose the song for your intro. I just like the song. And you should probably play Gross and Guardi. Four six four ends. Four Hala. Three Guzma. Four Hala? That actually might work. But no, it's not great because you're. There's a lot of games where you don't play a lot of uh, Hala. There's there's a lot of games where you don't play your GX attack early. I pl I played Metagross for a long time with this. Like you only really play your GX attack when you're stuck. But for the most part, you're not stuck. Thirty two people watching me struggle to type. <laughs> Get Splatoon 2. I'm not gonna get Splatoon 2. I'm not a big fan of Splatoon games. Okay, so they're not Lysandering this turn, so we still have a chance of winning. I don't know why they said GG. That seems odd. I think Alter will clunk it up, plus your Oko and Vulcan. Yeah, you don't want to play Alter. Yeah, I'm gonna go sleep. I'm getting Mega Tar. Alright, gang, guys. Like, get, some, get, get some good rest. Alright, so now we're caught up with the chat, finally. And I have to add 22 more <laughs> entries to uh, Nico Nico. So Nico Nico is really gonna enjoy this uh, Lele if they have a chance of getting it with that 77 entries. But to be fair, um, Pat had like 50% of the entries and still didn't win the, the Shaman Full Art. So that's not a knockout yet. What do I do here? I wish I had an N right now. That would have been nice. Do I Sycamore? I think I have Sycamore. So I'm really stuck. And I am going to draw the cards I need, maybe. I could also Lysander. Do some damage to this Trampa. Because I could be knocked out next turn, so I'm probably going to have to retreat. I'm just going to Sycamore. Like, it's probably a bad play, but I'm already way behind anyways. Okay, we got the Darkrai. 
get an attachment for the turn. We ultra, do we ultra ball? I don't think we ultra ball, not yet. How many Lele's are left? Is this one? Oh, never mind. There's no more Lele's left. I guess we do Ultra Ball then. Get rid of these two, because I'm probably going to play it next turn. I have a, another Darkrai. Just kind of set up the field a little bit. Okay, don't, re don't retreat. No, don't re miss me up on me. Let's retreat here. Let's O-Wing. into this dark right here. All right, so we have a decent chance of winning this game, I think. All right, why do you hate squids? I don't hate squids, I just, like, I haven't played the game. Like, I haven't played the game, and I just don't want to get into the game because there's more time I got to be wasting. <laughs> Hala and Ninetales? Mm, it could work, and I might try it out, but I don't know. Like, once again, like, I do, I know for a fact to use a GX attack in every game when I play Hala, uh, when I play Ninetales, for, for a fact, so it could work. And it might be worth trying, but I don't know how many I'd play. Like, maybe two, but then I'd have to get a second Hala full art if I want to try it out. I don't know, we'll see. I'll try it out in the future. Is that game? I think that's game. One, two, three, four, five. That's so frustrating, man. Yeah, it's game. That sucks. That was a well played. That was garbage. Why am I getting stuck today? I usually, like, play this like play this deck super, like, mindlessly and win every game. That's so frustrating. Oh, I, I had, like, 13 win streak with this deck. And I'm missing out on coins right now. Is Shay excluded? Shay's gone. Let me actually write down the fact that I want to show off the uh, Metagross. Metagross post list. I want to show off what I would try. Like, what's gonna. Oh, there we go. Now we have a hand. And we're going second, which I don't know if that's good or not. But at least we have a field for once in our lives. Or please save us. Oh, is the stream gone? Oh no. No, the stream's here. We're set the stream. We are we okay? We're okay now. All right, cool. I've been talking this whole time, guys. I didn't notice the stream was going crazy. Jampa's decent metagross. It's okay. I I think I'd rather play Necrozma to be honest. Hey, or I want to pull a choice band secret. I want to pull a choice band secret. Wish me luck. Good luck, man. I want to pull three. So wish me luck as well. Psychotic quads, what decks will eventually be what what decks will everybody be using against Metagross decks? I mean Metagross I mean Greninja and um, Volcanion beat it. And like I don't know, like that's that's good I guess. The stream was gone for a few seconds. Well thank you for letting me know. <sighs> Luckily the stream isn't spazzing out too much today. But uh hey, you guys are the best. We have 20 people watching. Go ahead and drop a like if you have not already. I mean, it looks like most of you have, so shout out to you guys. For sure. I need, a, I need to get a box to put all my binders in, I think. And like put that box like in my under my bed or something. Because these binders are taking up space in my room. Playing against this. Interesting. Um, let's do this first. I don't want to play in. I'm going to try to play Sycamore this turn. Let's do this. Yeah, we're going to play Sycamore this turn. And we have a O-Wing target as well by doing this. So seven cards, more Max Luxor targets, more tools we can put down, things like that. And this is this is Garbodor, so we have to be careful, but our Dark Rides have resistances. So I think in the end we'll be okay. Ooh, we can get rid of a Pokemon and oh they're probably gonna no actually getting rid of Lele, is that good or bad for us? Lele is kind of annoying for, to battle against. So I'm gonna actually I don't mind what they get rid of, but they can they need to get rid of something. We have our stadium, we have Lysander, we have Sycamore, we have options for next turn, so that's good. Good, I'll take that. And I'm not gonna put that down yet. Should I actually? They're playing Jampa. They're probably playing the stadium, the uh, Team Magma Stadium. So I'm actually okay with making this play. And I know that gives their Jampa a hard hitting attack, but once we set up our field, we'll be able to knock them out anyway. So I think we'll be alright. I think we'll survive. And we can eventually field blow with a choice fans or just Lysander around as well. I guess this isn't a threat to me. No change is needed. That's true. Um, Rogue and Volks are near auto wins versus Metagross. Yeah, they're gonna be in a pretty they're gonna be pretty common in the meta. Is that choice man? That is choice man, I have to be careful. 
Now I have to be extra careful. Um, I think I'm going to Sycamore here as well. And just kind of set up my field for a bit. Actually, no, because I want to attach as many energies as possible. So I think I have the Sycamore here. Unfortunate, but it's not too bad either. Because I need, I need to knock out that Drample in one hit. Touches here. This here. Put down another Dark Ray, so we have a bunch of Dark Rays ready to attack. And we'll O-Wing into this Dark Ray. So we have a bunch of energies on the field now. And even if they knock out a Dark Ray, we'll have another two more pretty much ready to attack. So one, two, three, four, five, six on the field, that's 120. 140 with damage. So if we get one more energy in a choice band, we get a knockout. I'm not gonna do that yet though. In fact, because I want to Lysander this next turn. So I'm actually good if I Oblivion Wing one more time. And then I can Lysander this next turn. Even if I have to manually retreat it. There we go. Feels looking strong now. This is how the deck should run. What would you guys do if Aura gives us lemons? Uh, I like lemonade. I'd probably make lemonade if I were you guys. Squirt them in the eyes of my enemies. <laughs> That's a good answer. Heavy balls and Vikabulu Saw Blue has a nice is is good frog and guardy matchup as well. This is true. I don't know about guardy though, because you can't hit 230. They can ace a roll. Um, they actually will knock you out because you have to have three energies attack. So I don't think the guardy matchup's great, but I think the the other matchups are pretty good. How many coins we got? Oh, we're still like 50 coins short. Oh, but we're going to get a bunch of coins if we can pull this off. All right, so let me go ahead and go to Metagross and then just for a little bit, just to kind of see what I have to do. How do, how do Bulu be card? I was looking Patrick. Um, Metagross. Okay, so what would I do? Well, let's take out the things that don't work anymore. Uh, I'll keep these for Guzma, so I'll probably make it a 3 Guzma line. I could even bump it up to 4, to be honest. Now, let me make this 3 ends. Actually, I'm going to make it 4 ends, because you need all the draw supporters you can get. But I'm not a big fan of Hala. Like, I just find myself not using my Jix attack as much as I should, I think. Alright, 4 of those. You definitely don't need Karen anymore, so you can take out Karen. Uh, Rescue Stretcher. I like Max Potion more than I like Acerola. I'll probably still play Acerola. Maybe like a one of you don't need to queue anymore either. So um let me think about this. You can hit 170 or 200. I don't think this is worth any more than I think we can take those out. Uh Vulpix. Uh we can still play Vulpix. I think Vulpix is fine. Mm, I think you can play your fourth max potion now. I like that number, I like this number. Yes, 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 yes. Four sycamores. You don't need Olympia because you're playing. You're playing. Um, what's it called now? You up the. You up the psychic energy count. So I think you play. Four psychics. It also gives you a bunch of energies as well. You play four psychics and a, and a necrozma for sure. If you like necrozma a lot, play a second one. I'm gonna put a Mewtwo in there, as an eye, just just to kind of give you an idea. We'll put like this me 2 gx I guess. EX, I mean. Uh, other than that, what do you guys think should be added to the deck? We could add more rescue stretchers. Um, maybe Acerola would be pretty decent. Although, I'm not too sure how decent. We could maybe even try the Hala. How many? We have four, three choice bands. Three choice bands is good. Guard needs to commit six energies to KO it. But they have choice band. And then that's really, really, really easy. That's DCE. That's like two DCEs on a fairy energy. And their abilities to attach fairy at every turn makes it so fast. So, like, that's not too bad either. And that's assuming, like, what was that? To hit 180, you have to hit six, which means you have to have three energies on yourself. And all Gardevoir needs to have is two and a choice band, and that hits 180. And if you have a Fighting Fury Belt, they just feel blower or they attach more energies. Because you have to account that it's both Pokemon, not just yourself. Because I think, right, that's right, like 180 is 30 divided, like 30 divided by 6. 30 times 6 is 180, yeah. Blue is faster in a sense you can't, it's, uh, it's, I don't, I don't really terribly agree with that, Nick. It's, the Guardian's very fast as well. 
And the Drampa with GX is okay. I, I don't know, you're probably, like, this GX is better. Algorithm GX is just a better GX attack. You both run the risk of being end, and this is literally just a better GX attack. Like, you may not be drawing 10, but you're getting 5 exact cards, which is better. Or please don't ban me. Don't promote your Discord, bro. <laughs> Blue removes the energy itself, though. Yeah, but through an attack. Oh, yeah, that's, that is true, though. That is true. I'll give you that much. But once again, you still don't knock me out. And well, like I said before, it's so easy to get six energies. Like I just played. I have I have a Garbodor, a Gar uh, Gardevoir, and I play tested it against Joseph today as well. And it was Greninja, so they also had to have six energies to knock me out, and they easily got it all the time. And I also play tested it against uh, uh, what's it called, the uh, Glisspod in that video I have. And it's just it's really you. It's really easy. Can you play Greninja? I can play Greninja. But right now I want to play Darkrai just to kind of get some coins. Once I get the coins, I'll be good. You know, I think Solgaleo is worth playing. Not at all. I think Solgaleo is so bad in Metagross. Attack with Gallade. Yeah, Gallade hits 130 though. It's not good enough. Like, you have to get a Kakui and a Choice Band and you don't play Kakui anymore because it's not very good anymore. No, uh, I think 30, 12 energies is a really good number. I don't think you need more than 12. Uh, you have your 4-4 four, four draw support. You have your 3 Guzmas, your 1 Bridget. What else do you play? Still a lot of energy in Blue can run through Guardian Pork and... Four can do anything, I think. It's GX that heals it. Plus Ace Roll is great for Blue, so if Guardian can't one shot. Yeah, but unlike you, like unlike your deck, Ace of Roll is like you can't re uh, I don't know. Like I, I understand what you're saying, but I have a hard time believing it. Like I, I'd have to see I'd have to see physical proof. Cause like I, I understand where you're coming from, but after playtesting Gardevoir and playtesting Vickable, I think Gardevoir is better. But that's just me. I could be completely wrong, and if I am completely wrong, that's fine. Use Delmize. I don't like Delmize. Because, like, what does Delmize do for you now? Like, if you play two Delmize, you can hit 170. But your bench is going to be relatively full all the time anyways. 170 is whatever, because you can just play Choice Band. Honestly, I'd rather just do that. Fourth Choice Band is really, really strong. Um, I honestly, like, a third Lele could be good, too. I don't like playing three Leles in general, though, so I'm not going to do it. Let me take one last look to see what I'm missing. I could play Acerola. On top of Max Potions. I'm not too sure how great that is, but it's a possibility. Um, I could also play Float Stones, although I don't like Float Stones in this deck. Especially since you're playing, um, what's it called? Um, Guzma. Anyway, so you'll have retreat options. Two Field Blowers is good. You could play Escape Ropes if you want to be that guy. I mean, Escape Rope isn't a bad card at all. I'm probably going to throw in one Escape Rope in this deck. And, I mean, I don't know what else you should play in this deck, to be honest. Like, the deck itself, the deck builds itself, and it does a really good job. Maybe another Rescue Stretcher, so you always have Pokemon. And an Escape Rope. Because you don't really care about your, you don't care about playing too many item cards, because Greninja, uh, Garbodor is not a threat to you. When Delmise helps with Lapras. Uh, you know what? Maybe that's worth trying out. One Delmise is good. I mean, Lapras isn't terribly popular, but I, I do I do like that argument. So I'm actually going to agree with you and try out one Delmise. But I don't like two. I only like one. So we're going to play just one. When you get a chance, check the Upload Ideas tab. We'll do Nebby. Uh, Nathan, one Delmise. Hope that. Yeah, two turns to six energies was fairly consistent. Yeah, Joseph can tell you. Joseph was the person I was battling against. Mobile Gods, will you help me make a deck? Sure. I mean, we're just kind of chilling today, so that seems like pretty good. New Guard is broke, absolutely. Um, spam Ace Roll with, with what, with what versus Seeker? What are you talking about? I mean, they can just play four. They, like, Super Scoop will play as Roll is a good argument, Patrick. But in, in, like, once again, getting the energies to get consistent Oko's, because, like, here's the argument to me, right? Bulu can do damage very easily, but Gardevoir can very easily get Oko's. <laughs> like, Bulu can't Oko Gardevoir unless they play Kakui. And if you're playing Kakui, your deck's probably inconsistent anyways. Uh, while Gardevoir can fairly easily get Oko, six energies is nothing. Choice Band plus five energies is nothing for Gardevoir. It's so 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 simple to pull off. Um, so that's 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 my argument there. Two. Less psychic energies, just one. No no no, this is for Necrozma. Necrozma is a really good attacker in this deck. Um, because if you're like obviously you're weak to psychic, but if you're playing against a psychic deck, just don't play the Necrozma. But four psychic energies. Because uh, you don't need that many metal energies. You only need three in the discard pile at any one given time. So the four is just, and not to mention that like one of those is a colorless placement. 
So the four is there for Necrozma, because Necrozma is so good in this deck. Skyla. Ooh, Skyla could be good, actually. I'm going to play a Skyla. I like Skyla. Just got a Lele for 36. Hey, shout out to you, bro. Your boy Nelly. I'm back at it again. Nelson, what's poppin', man? How you been? I'm going to play it. I'm going to put in a Skyla. Nice to see you. I'll probably take out... Oh, uh, no. I, I kind of want to keep Escape Rope if I play Skyla, though. I like Skyla. Just because Skyla is just a good card in general. Uh, oh, there's two Escape Ropes in this deck. All right. Never mind. There we go. Fixed. <laughs> Don't try to fix it. that deck isn't broken on my own. I'm so done right now. This laptop sucks. I'm sorry, Patrick. <laughs> um, Loki thought about running in the Crossman. No, it's so good in Metagross. Have a good night, uh, Blake. I still think Blue can do good against Guardi. Guardi is great. Don't get me wrong. I think it's just 50-50. That's fair. That's a fair argument. Um, I can agree. I can I can stand by that. Guard does does need to stream stage two though. That's easy. <laughs> have you you guys? If you guys have any questions about streaming stage twos, and um, the streaming guardies in general with Acerola, I have a video going up probably tomorrow or the day after that of Gardevoir versus Galissapod, which in you would think in theory is a bad matchup because Galissapod only needs one of energy. Um, and I have a video a while back on my channel that's Galissapod versus Gardevoir as well, that once again shows off the power of Gardevoir. So. Go check that out if you have any questions about how how streamlined is guardable. Because like the streaming stage twos is not hard at all. For post format, I have Skyline Heavy Ball right now, and I've been in the fence by using Kakui or Hala. I don't like Kakui. Hala's okay, but I, I wouldn't personally play it. But I understand people playing it. Um, I don't like Puzzles of Times. I thought I would like Puzzles of Times, but I don't think it's good enough to be honest. Plus, you don't really need it in this deck. There's not many cards you want to get back into your hand. Um, I run a single nine tails. I personally don't like that, but I like I like the idea and the argument behind it. But at the same time, I've just I've tried it and I just I just felt like it was in the way a lot. Oh, PK, okay, it's written that Crosmo. I'm in love with Guardi. Guardi's great. I says on Maria. Hey, Aura again. I forgot to plug in my phone, so I died. What happened while I was gone? We're just talking about the nine tails. We're talking about uh, Metagross deck. We're talking about Meta uh, Gardevoir matchups. Just things like that. We're just kind of chilling today, just having conversations, playing random games. Speaking of playing random games, let me just do post post Metagross. Me too. Yeah, me too. Is supposed to represent the crowds. Well, like obviously we don't have these cards right now, so that's just what I'm doing for the time being. Um, second Bridger for consistency. I never like that. I, I personally have never liked it. I found that I'd rather one one and risk it being prized because to me Bridget is a luxury card. It's not a it's not a card that you need to have in your deck, but it is nice to have when it works. Um, so to me, Bridget's a luxury card. Plus, if I play two, there's always a Bridget that gets in the way, no matter what it is. Every single game. It's frustrating to me. So I like playing just one. Been super busy, but glad to be back. Dude, tell me why it's impossible to pick up a Bridget. Dude, it's so hard to find them, bro. Good luck, dude. Luckily, I had a because I because I, I get master set collections. I get well whenever I was doing X Y, I was more focused on getting one of each ultra rare. So I managed to have a Bridget just laying around. But um, but uh, I want another one. <laughs> but I don't. But it's okay. I don't really need it. Just subs. Did somebody subscribe? Did I miss it? Oh, okay. Bridge is amazing, yeah. I play Bridge. There's already a Bridge, and there's no worries. Nice. Hand, hand, hand. This is actually a pretty decent start. I like this start. Fortunately, we're giving him a bunch of cards. And we're going first, though, so that's pretty handy. Sometimes I tech a Genesect. Ooh, Genesect's actually not too bad either. If you want to play a Genesect in there, it's pretty decent. I think with, uh, I think with, uh, I think that the new tech, though, is going to be just, uh, Necrozma. Because it pretty much is the same thing. Except it doesn't have that really de decent ability. Um, so that's something to keep in mind as well. What are your thoughts on Ho? I think Ho is great. And uh, oh, hold on. Oh, oh, oh. Well, thank you, um, Patrick, for putting my video on the chat. I always just clicked it and it sent my chat to a different link, so I can't see the chat right now. So give me a couple seconds. I'm just gonna give him a hello. Um, let's Ultra Ball away. Alter and energy. Do this and let's grab a Lele. Probably play N here. Give me one second, guys. I have to I have to open up the chat again because everything got messed up. But thank you, Patrick, for putting the video link in there for me. 
Um, play this. Play Bandinators. Play this. Let's get myself an N. Ho oh is great in Volcanion because it's a hard hitting attacker. It's easy to set up in Volcanion, and you still have Kiawe in the deck as well. And you can boost it up to like insanely hard hitting amounts, which is why I like it. So I'm actually gonna put an energy here. Because I can attach to here later, I'm not, it's not a big deal. Um, how, how did you get all your cards on PCGO? Just years of grinding out, bro. I think the deck is extremely good post rotation. Would running Scizor Max Megasus be a good meta call? I don't know actually. I don't think it's that good because you're still you're still weak to Volcanion, and that's the main reason why Scizor fell off anyways, is that it's weak to Volcanion. But a lot of these decks aren't playing special energies, and the ones that are, like like Ninetales, like you already auto you already auto win. Being a metal deck is good because you do Oko Gardevoir. But like this like I said, there's a whole circle of decks that are like really good against each other. So like it's all it's all a toss up for me. I don't know. I'd have to try it out. I don't have any specific cards I think that are great right now. Do you think Guardian will be run with Mega Guardian with a Brilliant Arrow? I do not think that at all. I think that makes it very inconsistent. Uh, my best my opinion, Ethan. But what's up, Ethan? How you doing? Dude, my boy visually got featured on a Verlis video. Been a mod from for ages, so it's hilarious. That's funny. Bandinators. Rescue Switcher at 2 seems smart with playing Sycamore at 4. Have you considered Sophocles from the new set? Get the energies in the discard pile for later. <coughs> oh. <coughs> Sorry for dying there. Uh, no, I don't like Sophocles. I think Ultra Ball and Sycamore is enough to get energies in the discard pile. That and manually retreating should be fine. I don't like Sophocles as a card personally. <clears throat> I feel like it's like one extra. How, it's like one extra how. <laughs> uh, that's what I personally think about it. <clears throat> Sorry about dying though. Whew. Oh, that hurt. <laughs> Do I want to? <clears throat> Can you do a face scan stream when you hit 2K subs? I might randomly do like one once a week if that's the case. That might be fun. Uh, do I need to accelerate too much? I don't think so. I think I'm just good to oblivion win here. Do that. Yeah, but I've revealed my face before. Also, I have an Instagram where my face is up randomly. So there's that. Uh, whew. Go to a Sun and Moon stream to see his face. Oh yeah, I have a Sun and Moon video series I never finished on the channel as well. I don't see how Pokestream dies while playing PCGO. I see it now. So Poke Streamer dies. Unmod Nevi? What do you what Nevi do? You don't want to see it. Nah, I'm joking. Don't ban me. <laughs> poor, poor Nebs. Whew, guys, I'm still like dumbfounded. I need you guys to know that in today's live stream, in just today's live stream, we have made $78.50. You guys are the absolute best. Good luck with your matches, man. Gotta go. All right, Nathan. See you around, bro. We're talking. <laughs> the YouTuber dies during stream for talking about Cardi dislikes. <laughs> Facts. Chapter six later, Nebby. Right now we're just kind of chilling and doing things. Those are usually during the end of the day. Do you think? What do you think about Turbo Dark post rotation? I think it stays the same. Like this deck list doesn't play any. Um, <clears throat> this deck doesn't. This deck doesn't play, doesn't play any VS seekers. Uh, I think at least. I don't think it does. Um, you just play four Guzma with the four Lysander, and everything else in the deck kind of stays the same. In fact, it's probably a little bit better because you have Acerola. You also have Wish Baton as well, which is also really, really good. Although I think I like, I do think I like, um, what's it called more? The uh, <clears throat> one, two, three, four, nine, four, six, eight, eight. It's not enough yet. Um, what's it called? What's it called? Like my head hurts right now. <laughs> Uh, <laughs> I'm gonna say more. Um, I like Experience Share more. I think I like it more than Wish Baton, but I still would play Wish Baton in there. Let's do this. I'm trying to empty my hand so it's not too big at any given time. Just because of uh, what we got going on here. Do that. And I want to keep this stuff in my hand. So I'll take the damage for this. I still have uh, energy down there, right? Oh, I don't. I thought I did. Oh, well, that's fine. This works out anyways. 
<clears throat> My friend is gonna run a one mug. It's a fun deck. I definitely recommend it. I feel bad for the gas cash. Joseph, don't, bro. I mean, you've done me big favors by driving me around, bro. It's all good. Well, I get all my games. I, I like Mirror Edge Catalyst today. I got. Oh, that's awesome. My most recent console is the Wii, so. <laughs> would you play Decker GX and post rotation Turbo Jack? Uh, I would play a one or two of, yeah. Just because, you know, why not, right? It gives you free dark energies just as an ability, so that's pretty decent. World's War and League Cup coming up soonish. That's pretty dope. Good luck with that, man. We just did one today, or there was one at my league like two days ago, I think. I don't, I, I didn't play in it because I didn't feel like it. But it was, uh, it was pretty dope. If I did play, I probably would have got a secret DC like my buddy Joseph did. <laughs> Monsters, man. Um, let's play this here. It's Max Elixir. Nice. And here we got all the energies on the field now. We have a Lele as well. Do I want to play the Lele? I want to get another stadium. I lost two of them so far. Oh, three of them so far. And that would be a good time to have a Skyla in the deck. <laughs> I'm not going to lie. There's 27 cards in the deck, so we have plenty of cards up in the deck. How many stadiums do I have? Do I have the one? I do have the one. So let's see if I can draw it off the Sycamore. That is the goal right now. Yeah, I would play this deck, and the cards that I would take out, I'd probably substitute for Dark Cry GXs or something. Because everything in this deck is good. There's nothing... I, I don't have any issues with this deck. Stadium? Ah, oh, so close. By so close, I mean not at all. But we can O-Wing here. Just handy. <coughs> but the field is set up. We can just take Knockout after Knockout after this. And we have Lysander as well for the Shaman, so we can take a cheeky two prizes. Because I'm deciding between Guardian and Turbo Dark. Gonna run Charge EX Cap, but good luck, Nelson. My boy. Anyways, we have 28 likes. I'm gonna drop a like if you, if you guys do, if you guys haven't already. It's always greatly appreciated. I don't know why that was so difficult for me to say. Charge EX is Ultimate Cap, but you just play like Charge EX, uh, what's it called? Charge EX Beware, DCEs, and like, uh, and like just mill your opponent with Flipteeny as well. Can't forget Flipteeny. You don't have a real mill deck until you play Flipteeny. Speaking of DC, I'm gonna bring out my Guardian. I'm already buying a Secret Fairy at the moment. I'm gonna get some nice Secret cards. How many Fairy Energies are you playing, uh, Patrick? I'm playing 10 right now, and I really like it. <laughs> I really like 10. 100 damage. All right, so 100 damage is whatever. Like something's gonna be knocked out regardless this way. So let's put it on you. So where do I put this? I think uh, I think I'm gonna Lysander the Shaman. <coughs> This turn and play it down the Citadel Widow. I don't care about being N because it does not really affect me too much. He has to get rid of his Phantom, I think. And I have to empty my hand as well, which is not great because this Trevenant is really scary. But nothing can Oko me. Yeah, so I'm not too worried about that. Trevenant does how much? 30 for each trainer card 30, 60, 90, 120, 150, 180. He has exactly enough to knock me out. So I think I play... Do I play end this turn? I, oh, I can't play end this turn, but you guys get the idea. So I just do this and grab a Darkrai, just for funsies, I guess. We'll get our we'll get our knockout this turn. We emptied our hand so that this thing isn't a threat. As long as we don't draw get two trainers off this, we should be okay. And that seems very unlikely in this deck, especially since most of our trainers are in the deck already. Dark and Choice Man. Uh, I mean, that's fine, I guess. Choice Band's pretty good to have, at the very least. Actually, it doesn't help us at all. Never mind. <clears throat> it's clean, but I'm building World Tournament. I don't know about you. I like 8. I played 8 at first. I think 10 is too much, but I don't know. I have to try it. I haven't tried it out with 10 yet. Joseph has. Joseph seems to be doing really pretty well with the t with uh, 10, so I think I like 10. I don't know. We'll see. 15 days until I start high school. Hey, Patrick. Good... Good that you put the energy on Lele. I watched the game with the stream with all the energy on Darkrai. Super dumb. No. There's some pretty new um, TCGO streamers out there. Like I'm pretty hyped about that because that means we're getting more people playing TCG. So it's getting more like traction and stuff like that. So that's great. I always like whenever like TCGO gets more support. But I mean they're new players. You can't you can't get mad at people for being new. You just kind of teach them how to be better. <coughs> Revitalizer. So I'm hoping he puts out another Shaman at some point. That'd be pretty nice. 
Luckily we don't need too many energies on the field in this game. And I can manually retreat into a uh, into my other Dark Rider on the bench. And if he gets a Dark Rider knockout, we'll just set up another Dark Rider after that. Uh, N is going to be good because... Actually, it gives him 5. Never mind. Oh, actually, N is kind of good because that forces him to play 2 cards. Poltergeist is whatever. We just have to dodge knockouts for the next couple of turns. But I manually retreat unless I get my Stadium here, which I did not. We'll attach here, just in case. Choice Band on... I'd rather have it on Dark Rai. Actually, Lele is pretty good too. But, uh, yeah, I'd rather have it on Dark Rai. We'll play N. We will get a couple... Oh, we got the Stadium, so that's actually really, really nice. And we'll get our knockout here with our other Dark Ray. While keeping all of our energies intact. So we'll Dark Pulse here. So, oh yeah, Coco's going to be great. I'm actually going to record a video using just a straight Coco deck here soon. Uh, it's going to be Coco, just scoop up Coco with, uh, versus Noivern. I want to see how the matchup is. Big Moss has a card that Ward's opponent played that made his opponent win. It was ridiculous, man. Bad cards make good bad decks. It's fun. <laughs> Well, you should come to Georgia and meet people like Alex Hill, Connor Felton, and the best senior in Georgia, me. <laughs> sure thing, man. How many? Ah, oh, though there goes all my stadiums. He gets another knockout here, but I think we're all, I think we're still okay. So the basic, sure, 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 sure. I think I have to load up a Lele. Oh no, he just forfeits. All right, can we get some money? Can we get some money action, please. I'm trying to just get enough money to uh, to buy this stupid thing. This is frustrating. Uh, <clears throat> Hello, I'm from Brazil. Hey, what's up, Ryan from Brazil? How you doing? Thank you for showing up to the stream. Always appreciate it. I mean the card though. I mean this is why the actual food item known as malasada. I want some malasadas myself, bro. I've always I've, I know that me and my buddy Carlos are supposed to bake them at some point. We just haven't had time yet. These hands are getting a little bit weird. Um, we are going first. This hand's, it's a pretty decent hand, though. Instead of all these cards. And... Oh, we're already going first, so I guess there wasn't really a reason for us to do that. But we get some mulligans, which is handy. What are we playing against? Greninja? Looks like Greninja. Alright, Greninja. How do we beat Greninja? We don't let them set up. So I had to get really, really fast and start attacking hard with Darkrai, so... This so looks like we're gonna be digging a lot this game. But luckily, Suda Widow's here, so they can't get too insane with their bench. I mean, I'm here, we town Brad Kuzo, he's in the world's repping H-Town. Hey, 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 hopefully he wins, right? <laughs> it's like a foreign donut with don with no hole, I know, right? I want it. Draw, draw, all the draws. All right, good, we got Max Luxor and a stadium. That's already a really good start. On top of the, uh, but I don't want to use, I can't, I can't afford to go for O-Wing too much this game. Hello, signal over here. Hopefully we get some ends. We have a Lele and an N in our hand. Oh, we didn't do anything this turn though. I have to end him next turn. Hopefully he doesn't get to my stadium either. <clears throat> we do hit 60. I guess that's pretty nice. Or you should come to Killian and do nothing since Killian is boring as hell, but you could be the worst senior in the country, me. <laughs> Wait, you live in Texas, never right? Dude, Killian have you ever been to Killian's though? Like the barbecue place? That place was dope. That was going my last year as a senior in rotation, but since my birthday was coming international, I'm going to be a master at 14. Oh, boy. Hey, Michaela, nice to see you. Long time no see. How did they do 60? Oh, they play Kui. They play Kikui, Greninja. I mean, it's not bad, but it's not great either. All right, so I think this turn, since we don't get a knockout, we're okay to play... Um, we're okay to just owing. Just kind of set up the field. If I can get another Dark Ride down, apparently I can not. It would have been nice. It would have been nice. Okay, I'm gonna keep that in my hand in case I want to play Lele next turn. Play this. Put energies on the bo on the board. <clears throat> we'll owing here. We will put them on Yveltal. Yveltal can actually get a knockout. Well, actually, no, it can't. Never mind. Whatever. It's on. It's on Yveltal. Can you know, it work post rotation? Or are they losing too much? I think it works great. I just you just replace the dive balls and the seekers with uh, timer balls and more consistency cards. You'll be good. I've been playing it a lot myself. It's a lot of fun. Oh, there goes my experience here. Never mind about that. More likes and people watching. Yeah, people keep coming and going. 
Or we're getting in and out, so now we can still choose Whataburger over it. Oh, we're getting in and out? I want to try in and out though. <laughs> I've never had it before. It, it looks like a good place. What's your favorite place in San Antonio? I've, I haven't been in San Antonio in years. I want to go back. I, I always liked going to San Antonio. <clears throat> so do I play... Do I play N? What do I do here? I think I play N. And then I start getting some damage in the board. One, two, three, four, five. I do get a knockout this turn. Let's play N. Just because his hand is a little bit too big and I want him to not get out of Froak. I, I wanted to at least try to control a little bit. I guess I could also Lysander and get a knockout on this, but he just puts it back on the board. So I think N is good because it gets rid of whatever two cards he picked and I get my six cards as well. So, and once again, once I have Darkrai set up, I'm in a really good position in this game. We have another Darkrai, so that's pretty good. And if he knocks anything else, so we have a Lele as an option. Um, I haven't attached for the turn yet either, so that's going to go to a Darkrai. Put these in the discard pile. Let's grab a Darkrai. So lots of energies on the board. Two Darkrais, almost both of them ready to attack. We get free retreat because of our stadium, and we get our knockouts. So I think we're in a good position now. He can't set up a Greninja for free anymore because it gets a knockout every turn. <coughs> There's a Lysander, so if he does try to do any shen uh, retreating shenanigans, we'll be good. Except for Burning Shadows, extremely hyped. But that's one anything. How was the recent Dragon Ball Super episode? Yesterday's episode? It was pretty good. The art was a little bit weird here and there, but it was a really good episode. Waterburger is way better than In-N-Out. I mean, I like Waterburger, but Waterburger, like, I can't have too often, right? Because it makes my stomach hurt. <laughs> Forget In-N-Out. You need Taco El Gordo, buddy? I've heard it was really good, actually. It's, it's alright, but Waterburger is still better. <laughs> In-N-Out is the best. I don't know. We'll see. Miss Waterburger and Jack in the Box. Well, Jack in the Box is not that great. The burgers are not good in Jack in the Box. I hope he drew all of his Froggy for making that bad play. My favorite place in San Antonio is Six Flags. Six Flags is fun. We have a Six Flags here in Texas. Salsa or my boy, Miss You Men. You became a father that went to Walmart for milk and never came back. I mean, I'm sorry, dude. I just really like milk. I've been drinking it since that day. <laughs> Alright, let's go with that choice band on the field. I'm not a fan of it. What do I do here? Do I end? Do I hex? I think I saved the secret for hex, actually. Lysandering doesn't... I want to give her that choice band. Oh, what will happen here? Shadow Clock donated five dollars. Shadow Clock, first of all, I don't know who you are, but that's greatly appreciated. Apparently, you're a viewer and you and you appreciate the stream, so thank you so much. Are you like a different name or? Well, I've, ne I've never seen you in the chat before, but thank you, Shadow Clock. Shadow Clock, because you donated, you actually get an entry. So Shadow Clock, you have a chance of winning a a um, Tapu Lele on PCGO. Um, five entries. For every for every dollar that's donated so at the end of this month we'll see but thank you so much i really do appreciate it man you guys are the best today i've seen another version of darker that i like more the the dark ride gx i like the dark ride gx too i have jimmy john's almost daily to be honest is jimmy john's that good i've never been to jimmy john's but i know there's one relatively close to my house that i kind of want to try hey shadow clock is my boy i wish i got a waterburger love i find burger king to be better i guess i just don't like it which helps i think i think i think waterburger is better but burger king is like a little bit more affordable fight me shadow clock <laughs> calm it down nelson what's up jay jay pet paddle how you doing man no more luck dude i bring the luck is just not here anymore i miss him i hope i hope he's okay vamp law in and out burger is good but greasy it makes you it makes the blood clot this is true I wouldn't know for certain, but it sounds pretty true. Let's uh, put this here. Put a choice band on something useless. I can just put it on this, right? I'm never gonna really use it. I could have actually discarded it and played Ultra Ball that turn, but it seems unnecessary, so I'm not too worried about it. We'll attach here. And we can retreat. Uh, choice band is scary to me, so I'm just gonna retreat. Oh, women, I didn't re- Oh, I forgot my stadium wasn't, it wasn't there anymore. But regardless, it's still safer play. We still get the knockout. The only thing that sucks about this is that now, uh, oh, things are getting kind of scary now. I wish I didn't do that because I could have gotten knockouts with Greninja with uh, against a Greninja break too. Ooh, things are looking kind of scary now. I'm, uh, I, I I misplayed there. I thought I sold my stadium down. I'm a simple man that enjoys a simple sandwich. Hey, sandwich is a good one. Where I am is my boy. The Jimmy John's where I am is meh. Oh. 
Whoever said Jack in the Box sucks needs to chill. I don't like Jack in the Box that much. Like, I feel like other places are just better that are the same price. Jay Jones is so good. I had sushi and pizza, man. I'm so stuffed, dude. That sounds delicious. Hello? Where was my invite? You coming to Pokemon Worlds? No, I'm not going to be at Worlds this year. I got school stuff to go to that I can deal with as well. Well, there's a knockout there, which leaves me a Lele if I can get my stadium. I guess. Some arenas, where is it? I think I'm gonna lose this game, guys, which is unfortunate. Or I'm calling him out. Shadow Clock is Jay. Is Jay Shadow Clock? But like, he's. It would show up as. Actually, I don't know what it would show up as. To be honest, I don't know how that works. We need another knockout here, potentially. I can't play things that I want to play. How much damage am I doing? One, two, three, four, five, six, sixty, one, twenty. 140, it's not enough. Let's go ahead and knock out a Frogadier. Just to get a prize every turn. We still have four Lysanders in the deck that we can potentially get. And he has three Pokemon that are all knockout targets. And he doesn't have another Greninja down either, which is great. We got another Dark Energy, which is not great. But uh, we still have, like, how many Seekers? Like, I think we played two Seekers in the deck, so two Seekers and three Lysanders. We have a pretty good chance of getting everything we need. We can Lysander that out if we can get the freaking Seeker or Lysander next turn. I miss KFC Twisters. I've never had those. Nice, no, it's not GX. Not e the GX, not GX. I use the Hypno and puts both active Pokemon safe. Oh! Darkhead? Oh, use the other attack. Oh, I thought you meant, like, the other. Okay, I see what you're saying. One, two, three, four. Ugh, I have to get one more prize after this. I don't know how I'm going to do this either. I think I have to go for this. I think I have to attack this Pokemon right here. Is he going to deck out? I actually can't see my opponent's deck. No, he have 18 cards. Never mind. It takes me a while to type. Oh, what's up, Devin? How you doing, bro? Indiana is famous for the Indianapolis 500. I got to go after this match. All right, Michaela. Thank you for dropping by, though. I appreciate it. Can they win this game? We have a decent chance of winning this game if we load up Lele. Is that a good idea? We can actually load up Eveltal as well. And win the game like that way. I think that's what we have to do. Okay, one, two, three, four, five. We actually still get a knockout on this. Oh, we got the Lysander as well. I think we win, right? One, two, three, four, five, six. Do we win? I have to get a second Lysander next turn. Let me think about this. Two, four, five, six. It's 140 damage. So we can knock out this Greninja, which is the play I want to make. Um, I'm not going to be able to knock this out. And then I have to get another Lysander if I want to win with the Voltol, which is what I want to do as well. <sighs> this is tough. I don't know what I want to do. I could attack this, force him to retreat because if he doesn't retreat, he loses his only Greninja Break, but then I don't want this to be Greninja Break as well, so I think I'm going to do this. It's unfortunate, but it seems like the better play. Yo, what's up, Joe? How you doing, Victor, man? Oh, now you say hi. <laughs> Dude, I'm, there's so much going on in the chat right now, man. I apologize. Oh, Sycamore's great. What got you into streaming, and how did you keep up with all with well with your channel? I mean, I've been doing YouTube things for like two years right i've been doing uh, a lot of wi-fi and showdown at first and um that's been keeping me relatively consistent okay if i can get rid of a stadium like here's the way i can win next turn if i draw either a stadium card a seeker or a lysander so that's like there's two stadiums two lysanders and two seekers so that's six cards right um and there is 20 cards up to my decks so it's like a little bit over a little bit under a one in three chance of me to win next turn just based off top decks so that'd be pretty nice. I mean, that's a high chance, to be honest. So a little bit under a one in three chance to win. Let's see if I can pull it off. Giant Water Shuriken, where? Not to Eveltal, please, because I need that Eveltal to be alive. Do it on Lele. Lele is good because you win the game that way, right? Even though it doesn't really matter who he does it to. Okay, you did it on Lele, that's pretty good. So Lele, he needs to do it three times to knock me out. <clears throat> and how did I keep up with all well, and then like one day I was just like I'm just gonna stream just for the fun of it what's the retreat cost on this too this is one I'm probably gonna go into this one and uh I just kept doing it cause it was fun ah oh, unfortunately it's a max elixir I might lose next turn then 
If he has Lysander, I lose for sure. Let me play Smax Luxor, get it out of my deck. Yeah, let's see. They were, oh, they're, they, they were just right there, man. They were right there. Let's stick them here. So if I don't lose this upcoming turn, then I think I win the game. Darkrai, Energy, Eveltal. He needs one more prize, so I think I win. No, I lose no matter what, though. Actually, he can't knock out a dark rifle from full, right? So that's my best switch. But I could lose still. <laughs> he can't knock it out from full, so what I would need to do is top deck a dark energy now, because apparently that's easy, right? With all the dark energies that are gone now, ugh, what a pain. Uh, I need either top deck a dark energy. Or a stadium. I mean, I have so many cards that I could use. Two stadiums, and I think there's one. There's five on the field. Eight down there. I don't I actually don't think there's that many dark energies left. <clears throat> Nox is so stacked, pretty much. Call me Pappy. I think I'm good for given. Ultra Beast for Lele. Lab was in play. Yeah, I wanted to get Lele, but that's the lab. That's why I said if I get my stadium, then I win this game because I could replace the stadium. And just a lab. Okay, so we're just gonna make that play. Which means I have to win this upcoming turn. If I don't win this turn, then I lose. It's really that simple. So I have to get a dark energy this turn. I have to top deck dark or a way to get something. Uh, that doesn't work. Frogadier is a one retreat cost. I guess, right? Um, I can't retreat. So this is my only play. And I can't stop him from using his ability. It's my only play, <laughs> unfortunately. I'm gonna play out all the No, I, I wanna keep at least two cards in my hand, so let me just put this here then. I'll pass. What setup do you use for your computer? It's just a laptop. I use OBS, that's all I, that's the only thing that's special about it. Rip, put down two, put down choice bands. I only have to put down one, because if I get an Ultra Ball, that'd be pretty nice. Does he have an energy in hand? If he has an energy in hand, he wins. I think he does, right? But I don't know if he, I, I'm not too sure. Okay, well, we have another chance. Oh my God, this is insane. Okay, he doesn't have an energy in hand right now. So that's something at the very least. So, this is frustrating. I have two stadiums in there. Come on. Come on. There's so many stadiums in that deck. There's so many cards I could play. Okay, thank you. Dope. I'll just go ahead and leave. Oh, that's so frustrating. I'm just trying to get my freaking points. Let me get my money. I just need to get like 50 more cents or 50 more coins. Ah, oh, this is so frustrating. <sighs> okay. That's upsetting. That's very upsetting. But we're gonna keep going. It's gonna be a longer stream than usual because apparently we've already been streaming for two hours and I'm getting kind of sleepy. So we're gonna keep going though until I can get this stupid Xerneas thingy. I can't believe I lost that game just because of that garbage. Like that was so not. That was so frustrating. I should have won that game, but I couldn't get any draws that I could actually use. And of course we need Sudo at all because why wouldn't we? Actually, this hand's not too bad. We Lele, Ultra Ball, Experience Share, things like that. We have the Stadium. We can retreat if we need to. Max Elixir. Yeah, it's a pretty decent hand. Especially since we're going first. We do this. We do this. We do this. We do this. Boom, boom. We grab a Lele for Sycamore. And we play... Oh, this is my only Lele in the deck. I gotta be careful about that. We play Max Elixir for it, and then we uh, play the Sycamore. So we get to use up all the cards in our hand at the very least, but it's still like not great for us. <coughs> You Lele for a jump? Could you? I couldn't because he had Silent Lab, which turns off my Lele. In that last game, that is a lot of people. Like a lot of people are missing that there was a Silent Lab there. I could have Lele'd any time in that game, but I wouldn't be able to use the ability because of Silent Lab. You should just play Donk to Situate. I think I'm good. I'm not in the mood to do that today. Play Darkrai. Um, choice Band on the Darkrai. I don't want to retreat into Darkrai. I think I'm just gonna retreat into Lele, and then like potentially attack with Lele. I want to get things next turn. I'm losing all my supporters though, which is not great. Mm. 
garbage or garbage? It is garbage, to be honest. Shit, let's go to Space Cadets. Guys, come to Space Cadets, guys. I'll be there I'll be there tomorrow between um most of the day, right? 4 p.m. I'll be there 4 p.m. ish. Is like I think the latest I'll be there. And I'll be there all the way till close. Long streams are fun. They are fun. Remember who remember who remembers Saucy McCharles? Oh, I remember him. That's funny. Maybe be a, with a norm now or is two I think two is fine, but three is also good. Like three, they're both they both work to be honest. Like to me, I don't like it because of bench space. I find myself never needing to do it because of bench space. But we'll see. O wing, he got the O wing off, which is frustrating, but that's fine, I guess. I wonder if two field blowers, if three field, oh three field field blowers seems a little bit excessive, yeah. All right, so he's playing the same deck as us, so I don't need these stadiums anymore because that's the only stadium that's gonna be on the field. Another dark card down. I guess I could put Eveltal down as well, which is probably smarter, because I can also use uh, Owing. If I can get a Max Luxor land this turn, that is. Max Luxor? No Max Luxor this turn, unfortunately. Uh, so that means I'm just going to switch into Eveltal, I suppose. But I don't want to. I don't think I switch into Eveltal, actually. The Dark Ray. Yeah, I think I just stay in and take the damage and then retreat into Dark Ray and attack with Dark Ray next turn. But that's not a good idea either. I think I have to attack with Evolta next turn. I mean, this thing's already in range, so it doesn't matter how much damage this thing takes, it will be knocked out at some point. I'm not in a good position here. He's 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 winning so far because of based on speed. Well, Megros run two or three. I think just two is fine. Three seems too much. I have GF plans, maybe next week, my dude. Oh, okay. I live 10 hours away, so, ah, uh, sad. Or if I'm ever in the area, I'll go to Space Cadets. That's my boy. Appreciate it. Or you want to trade Evolto so you have something of the same type? That'd be kind of nice. <laughs> I'm not going to lie. Rip link doesn't work. What link? The Discord link? If the Discord link doesn't work, let me fix it. Um, Because apparently it's not working. Invite people. Copy again. Even though I literally just did this. I don't know why it's not, why not working again. By the way, guys, thank you guys all so much for watching. If you guys can, go ahead and drop a like. It is always greatly appreciated. This, and then we just do that. Then we do this. And this thing should work. It should update, right? Your changes are being saved. All changes saved. Dope. What did you do? Hit me for another 120. All right, dope. We are in such a bad position. <laughs> Come on. Okay, Max Luxor is good. I want to start O-winging this turn. <clears throat> I actually saw I want to start owinging a belted dark ray because that thing's actually kind of annoying One two he can't knock me out yet either I'm actually gonna do that instead of drawing this turn because I already attached for the turn actually I didn't but whatever I don't need to This thing's annoying I want to start doing the do Attach it here we can sick him more next turn or Lysander around some more Blue X on give giveaway all right cool or a check Always check active under the link. Always check active under the link. What do you mean? Or some train generation for Steam Siege one. Oh, okay, we'll do, bro. I want to set this link to never expire. Let's just do that again. It's, that way, it does not expire anymore. Cause I'm sick of updating this, to be honest. Okay, the saves. The changes have been saved. At least it should. Hopefully, everything works out. Um, he's gonna end me, which is good. I don't know, like doing. What, I didn't like the hand that I had. Unless he's not playing in this turn. I don't know. We'll see. He can switch out if he wants to, but I can just play Lysander again later. What's this? Um, we're in such a bad position, it's so frustrating. And he's gonna Lysander the Lele and get a knockout. One, I can knock, okay, what can I knock out myself? One, two, three, because I'm gonna get the energy back, right? So I'm gonna have two, four, six, it's 120, 140. 170 damage. It's not. I guess we can knock out a Lele. We can get a return knockout on a Lele. I can just get a manual attachment turn this turn. That'd be nice. Two, four, six. It's 60, 120, 140, 170. And then he gets a return knockout on us, I think. He doesn't have any experience shares on the board, though, so that's kind of handy. So we can go ahead and do that, because that would get us two cards, and I really like those two cards, and... Um, 
he has no experience shares on the board, so he have two, four. He only have five energies on the board, which means he can't knock us out. And we could potentially get a knockout next turn ourselves. So we're actually in a much better position now. We're in a much better position now. All we need is a dark energy on the board, and uh, we get knockouts on uh, even dark right EX because of our choice band. I think. Because we hit 170, 190, 190. Yeah, 190 plus 30 would be a knockout. 40 likes, and I'll give a full art dragon EX from Evolutions. Hey, Nebby. You guys are kind of dope right now. This is why you guys are moderators. I might have to make... I might have to make... Uh, Nebby and Mod on Twitch too. We'll see. We'll see. We'll see. <laughs> uh, uh, okay. That's a good stretch. Nebby just get in the bag. <laughs> Alright. I, I don't need him to be attaching energies like this. I don't want to be knocked out. We have two experience shares on the board, so we would keep all the energies, which is handy. Oh, please don't. Oh, okay, that's a knockout now. Mm. I can't believe you got all of those. That's frustrating. We can get a potentially, we can potentially get a, a, another knockout. We just need to get the freaking, um, we just need to get an, an energy attachment this turn. Not too hard, because we just have to draw it off a of Sycamore, but it's still frustrating. Oh, we can also just do that, right? Do I want to play N? I think I want to play N. Bring him down to two cards so he can't do much after this. We only, we'd only have, once again, five energies on the board. And we'll draw four. So we have a chance of winning this game. He just needs to whiff the knockout next turn and we win this game. We have Hex. Hex doesn't help us. Sycamore is pretty nice in case he draws again. No manual attachments this turn, but we do get a knockout. And that's what matters. Oh, we don't get a knockout. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I miscounted. Well, I think that's game then. Oh, man. That's upsetting. Damn it. Ah, oh, this is so frustrating tonight. I just want my money. Give me my money. That's all I want. That's literally the only reason why I'm here, and I can't seem to get it. <sighs> oh, man. Frustrating night, I swear. I went from going from like a 13 win streak to like a 2 win streak with this deck right now. I miscounted. That's my fault, too. I could have played that game smarter. I could have Lysandered around. I'll send the trade after the stream, Elox. No worries. Play some Guardi? I could play Guardi. I don't know. I just kind of want to play something mindless while I do other things in the background. But, like, I'm not I'm not drawing well tonight. Like, I'm drawing horribly tonight. And it's, like, getting really frustrating. And Gardevoir is not the deck I want to play when I'm drawing horribly. What's up, Lucas? How you doing? What are we playing against? Looks like Lapras. Play, why did I build this? I'm not doing that either. If I'm going first, I would have been. I am going first, though. Cool. Um, we get a couple draws here. We have two Ultra Balls to play. We can abuse. Uh, unfortunately, no draw supporter. Which is not great. But we have a bunch of good stuff here. Ultra Ball 1. We have to get a Lele. And a Darkrai. We get the Lele first. Unfortunately, I have to get the Lele. Because apparently... I play all that draw support and I can't get a single one off of 10 card hand. I'm losing a bunch of good stuff. I, I wanted to attach a choice band, but we have four in the deck. I think we'll be okay. I want to get a dark ride down. I don't want to have to rely on drawing it. Plus, I have nobody attached to choice band to anyways that I want to. I'd rather attach experience shares to all those. I put a dark ride down. One. It's fun. It is fun. It is a fun deck for sure, but. Uh, not right now, guys. Okay, well, it's definitely not what I wanted to see. I'll leave the Lele out there. No need to really do much with it. Luckily, we have a draw supporter, so we can actually abuse it next turn, but this sucks. <laughs> this is not a great hand. If you're trying to make Hokui Evolto break, you could do massive spread damage. I played it before. It's not great, because you're forced to attach a bunch of energies to Evolto, which is, like, okay, because it's self-sufficient to an extent, but three Dark Energies on one Pokemon, not that great. Oh, are we playing against Lapras? Or Ninetales and... Drampa? That's bad. I don't like Drampa and Lapras. Or, I don't like Drampa and Ninetales. It's not that great. Oh, you should try to make a... Uh, is there anyone who can show me how to use supporters the most efficiently? Like, when I start absolutely hating you swing more, but now it seems completely alright. I mean, just keep watching people play. Like, the best way to learn is to just watch people play, to be 100% honest. Like, just any competitive game in general. Like, play it yourself, and then watch people play, and then try to imitate what they do. That's how you play competitive games. It's the best way to play them. 
Can we win this matchup, Nine Tails? I think we can. I think we'll be okay. I, like we should be able to hit big numbers, and they can't knock us out without choice ban. And once they have choice ban, it's actually really bad for us because we don't play field blowers. Like the deck that won tournaments with us didn't play field blowers. He's gonna end me, which is actually not too bad. I did not like having four energies in my hand, and he's not ending me because he doesn't need to actually. So never mind. Do this here. Play another altar. Ultra ball for. Uh, we'll do another dark ray. Like as much as nice as it is to have an Eveltal on the field, actually I kind of want to do Eveltal because I can I can O-wing this turn if I need to. If I get a max look, so that is. Um, let's play second one here. Let's put more energies on the board. Weaken Nine Tails a bit. Having an Eveltal on the field, the field is always nice. And there's another Dark Rise so it ended up working out for us. And we have this. Can I please land this? I need to land this right here, right now. That'd be amazing. Thank you. Dope. All right, so we have this. We can start putting energies on the board again. Screen share on this, and yep, let's go ahead and start putting energies on the board, and let's just focus on getting Oko's. Boom. We couldn't Oko the Drampa anyway, so this works out very nicely for us. He needs to summon Lord Cranium. He's sleeping, or else I would. Helio looks. <laughs> my first time seeing Darkrai. Darkrai is a good card. It's a really good deck. It gets better post. It gets better post rotation as well, so that's gonna be fun. Uh, it's one of the uh, play meta ghosts if you a G. <laughs> Maybe not today. Megabyte, what's up, Megabyte man? Long time no see. Just play good people and get crushed. That's it. It's best that they're slightly better than you, but there isn't much more to it. It really isn't. Yeah, once you, once you, the, the more you play, and the more you watch people play, especially competitive players, the better you'll get. It's just really, really simple. What's he gonna, what's he gonna do here? I can't lie, Sander. I already have Metagrosses, it feels so good, A. Hey. What's up, Amanda? How you doing? That's a weird, Lucas, Ryan, that's a weird way to spell Mr. Ryan. <laughs> What's up, Alex? I'm glad to see all these people coming in today. Do 50 damage to me, who you think you are? Well, uh, the issue here is we have to weaken it to a non-awkward place. We already attached for the turn, so from here I think I attach to a Lele. Owing, we'll do 30. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. I already manually attached for the turn. 7 would be good damage, okay. I think we're good. Because I want to force him to use his GX attack earlier. <laughs> but I want to put it in range. I also want to get choice banned this turn, but I don't want to give him extra cards, you know, because that's going to be one extra card if I try to dig for a choice band, so I think I'm good. I mean, there's like two left in the deck, it's probably not worth digging for. We'll kind of, we'll slightly load up a top of the day, because unless he gets old choice band, he can't knock out my Pokemon from full, that my GXs. He needs choice band. I'm making custom cards so I can use Raichu GX tomorrow. A. Hey. Oh, that's annoying though. That's super duper annoying, I'm not going to lie. That means I need to get Choice Band now. Is Pat's on the chat? I need Pat to make a Mega Scizor deck for me. Your <laughs> stream, never mind, it's great. Free hug from Aura at 100 likes, this is a fact. I will give anybody a hug that sees me once we hit 100 likes on a video. We haven't done that yet. The save packs you get if you want to trade for stuff more easily. Yeah, that's the best way to go. Especially with this new set, just get a bunch of these new sets of pack, new packs from this set from like pre release and stuff like that. There's another field, but that's awkward. Um, experience sharing choice band is probably gone. How many stadiums are gone? I'm pretty sure I lost a lot of stadiums. Yeah, I lost three of my stadiums. Experience sharing choice band. Yeah, there you go. There they go. But we have N. I need to get my own choice band. He's gonna isolate again. One. I'm trying to put enough damage on the board though. He does have easy knockouts with all the ice blades on the, on the field. Ooh, there's my stadium, which is actually great. Um, I'm gonna attach this here because it no longer has experience share. Now, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. There's eight. That's 160, 180. It's 210 with a choice band. So if I can get a choice band off this end, we're in a really good place. I don't want to lose these cards, but maybe it's better if I do, so I can draw easier. I want to keep Lysander around for sure, but there's only there's no Lysanders in the discard pile yet, so it's probably worth playing. Let me get rid of a let me get rid of a evil. Oh, let me get rid of a Volta, Yeah, I was thinking about getting rid of Darkrai, but I know one of these Darkrai's are going to be knocked out, or one of these cards are going to be knocked out, and I would love to draw it. Let's see, choice bands. We have two choice bands in the deck. We have 17 cards left. We're drawing six. 
We're gonna have 18 cards off in the deck and we're drawing six. Can I get a choice ban? Nope. We can get a max looks here, but it doesn't help the knockout yet. Even if we land it. This is unfortunate. <clears throat> Put it here. Experience share. Experience share. And you'll put experience share on this. How about that? Okay, so two, four, six, eight, nine. Nine is 180. We're still 10 short. So we got a wing. That sucks. We have 11 cards up in the deck, but after this, we get knockout after knockout. And they don't have another uh, Lapras set up. They need to get another. They're not Lapras, Nine Tails. There we go. Yeah, once they get another Nine Tails set up, they're in a better position. But for now, we're in a really good position. Because we get knockout after knockout now. If he knocks out anything, we also have experience share. But Aura needs. I do need money, Brand. I'm broke as hell. Or mommy, if you're if you if I ever see you, I need you to make full eye contact with me when we hug. I'm okay with this. <laughs> Forty one likes. That is dope. Thank you guys all so much for all the likes, man. This, it was a really positive stream. We you guys donated eighty dollars today, over eighty dollars. That's so insane to me. You guys have been truly amazing today. This is a beacon here. Man, I wish I could end. Actually, I don't wish I could end. <clears throat> ah, this he does. He has no energies in hand, so he's relying on all. He's relying on a lot here. Lysander is exactly what I wanted to see. We'll do this. We'll knock out that nine tails on the bench. Actually, you know what? Oh, I don't have my stadium anymore. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. I'll knock out this because it's a threat to me. Is that a good idea? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. I messed up. I shouldn't have done that. I forgot I didn't have my stadium. I just keep looking at the chat and not realizing that my stadium's gone. That's so frustrating. Nine is 180, 200. We only hit 200. I need to knock out this. Not this Vulpix is going to knock me out. Mm, that's so frustrating. Why did I do that? It's okay. We still have two experience shares on the board. Even if he does knock us out this turn, we still have a decent chance of winning. All right, give me an energy, please. Yes, thank you. Energy is good because that means we knock out nine tails in return. So now we start exchanging prizes and we win the prize exchange for the most part. Like, even if he plays on this Lele to get a Sycamore or whatever. When do you do viewer battles for? I'm supposed to do them today, but I'm trying to get this coin so that I can have um, that Xerneas thing that they're selling right now. And I'm missing like 50 coins, and I could get it, but I keep... Why do you get Lysander? What's he trying to do? That seems very odd. Oh, he's trying to Lysander stall. Okay, that's fine. Um... I don't have any more stadiums I can get, so that was actually a decent play, I'm not gonna lie. But we can just keep O-winging, so like, that's whatever. Like, you have to attack me four more times. We have an N as well. Is N worth playing? I mean, we could lose. <laughs> we could very easily lose. I have to play N next turn, I can't play it this turn. All I need is attach one more energy. Just one more energy. So I have to play N next turn. Oh, it's so frustrating right now. This is so frustrating right now, guys. <laughs> It's frustrating that I keep not looking at the board and I look at the chat. That's the thing that's annoying. Okay, what happened? All four stadiums. Yeah, I know all four stadiums are gone, which means now I have to rely on getting an energy. And he's going to end for me, which is good. So how is so how and who is giving me the Dragonite? Oh, cool. Thank you, Nebby, for the for doing the giveaway. There's my stupid choice, man. Thank you so much for showing up now, guys. Also, thank you for not giving me an energy off that like I wanted. Oh, I hate this game. Um... Okay, he's just putting damage all over the board. He still needs... I don't know why he's doing that. It doesn't seem like a really good play. Can I please? Can I, like, please? <laughs> Do I attach this to both? I was attached to this, to be honest. If I do that, I end... I shuffle four. There's ten. There's seven. There's... Hold on. One, two, three, nine, nine. Oh, I have enough. I have enough turns to win if I do it that way. Yeah, I'm going to do that. Okay, I need the dark energy here, so if you could please hook me up with the dark energy, that'd be great. If there isn't a dark energy in these four cards, <laughs> oh boy, oh boy, am I going to lose it. Actually, I wouldn't even want to do that. There's no dark energy. I lose. I can't win this game because I'm stuck in the active. I can't win. That's game. I can't believe I lost to that garbage. Really? Really? I am so mad today, guys. I am so mad today. <laughs> it is becoming Salty Bomb real quick, like... Is real quick, like holy crap. Maybe I just shouldn't play Dark Ride today because Dark Ride does not seem to be co cooperating today. Oh man, 
is not Dark Ray is not cooperating with me today. I went from having a 12 win streak with this deck to only winning two games in a row. I am so angry. <laughs> I am so angry. All right, whatever. This is supposed to be the most mindless, relaxed stream ever. That was the whole goal today. And look at this garbage. <clears throat> at least we're going first, so we can Lele, Ultra Ball. Of course, we're playing another one of these garbage. I love Nine Tails to death, but what my opponent played was bad, and what I had to deal with was bad. We Lele first. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Of course, why is there always a Lele prize? It's prize every single time. We had like three energy prizes in that last game as well. So I mean, I mean that's to be expected, but come on, come on. 12 energy, one on the field. So we have 13 energy in total. Gotta keep that in mind. Then we have four energy priced. Wait, I, I should have played Anna. I don't know why I played Sycamore. To be completely honest, that was not a good play. Do this, 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 and we'll pass. I need my stadium next turn. Reveal yourself, you're the one who dislikes the stream. Are you guys disliking the stream? I mean, that's fine, whatever. You guys can dislike the streams if you want. It doesn't matter to me. Because, like, a dislike still supports me if you're trying to, like, de support me. And that's your goal. Is to make me not want to stream anymore. It doesn't matter to me. We I mean, we had like over two like what was it two almost two and a half hours of no dislikes on stream. It doesn't matter to me. Oh, did you lose? That'd be great. That'd be just great if you lost next turn. What kind of mic are you using? Just a headset. You sound pretty clear. I'm using actually a blue Yeti. I don't know how much they cost now, but they were pretty expensive back in the day when I bought it. Just because I want to get a stadium this turn. I'm doing this. Actually, you know what? It would probably be a better idea. Yeah, I was going to say this. Oh, man, this sucks. This sucks so bad. I went from winning this game to losing this game. I misplayed. I misplayed super hard that turn. I could have attached to this, retreated, and tried to land a stupid Max Luxor, and I misplayed this game. Ah, oh, okay. It's okay. It's okay. We still have a chance of winning because it's just Metagross. We can actually beat Metagross if things go our way. I'm so fr upset though. I misplayed. I hate that. When, I hate when that happens. I had to make sure I wasn't the only one. Okay. It was totally Nebby guys. Ban him. It's whatever. Oh boy. That's frustrating. I hate misplaying. I'm too tired. I have been streaming for too long. You don't have to dislike to uh, to take away your like. You can just click the like button again. Your like will be gone. For future reference. Mm, more beaconing. I just end this turn. It's so whatever. Okay. I just want to get this stupid Xerneas thing, guys. It's all I want. Don't ban Nebby, he's nice, he's my new friend. Nebby is nice, sometimes. Sometimes he's a mean troll. Most of the time he's nice though, right? I guess. <laughs> it's top deck right now. Let's get it. Um, put it there. Go in. Come on, give me my stadium. I wish I had Guzma right now. Why can't I ever get my stadium card? This is getting a little bit absurd. Just like an O-wing for something. Is it my hand? My hand is in my hand, okay. Oh, whoops, I meant, I meant to grab the Dark Ray. Whatever, it's not a big deal. Little we'll O-wing here. Put the energy onto Dark Ray. Where's my stadium card, guys? Can somebody help me? Can somebody help me get my stadium? Please, like, I would, I would love the help right now. Psychotic quads get used to playing a lot of Nine Tails and Metal Gross decks for a while. Nine Tails is not gonna actually. I don't feel like Nine Tails is gonna be that good post rotation. After like testing a little bit of it, I'm not. I'm not. I'm not super. I'm not super like a fan of it. But I've been. I've been maining Nine Tails since Guardians Rising. Like I know all about Nine Tails decks, which is why I played against it the way I did. But I just couldn't get the cards at the right moment. Like I kept whiffing the cards I have multiple copies of and having high chances of pulling them over other cards. 
I just kept whiffing them, so what can you do, right? Oh, looks like we're knocking out another Ninetales this turn. If I can get my Stadium, that is, please. Uh, do I just manually retreat? Because this is getting a little bit out of hand. I think I'm going to attempt to. I'll just keep ending as well. As well. Where is my stupid Stadium? I don't have an end for next turn, so I don't think it's a good idea. I think I'm just going to manually retreat because this is getting way out of hand. Way out of hand. I cannot draw my stadium for the life of me in this stupid game. When I play with all GX online, I would just yell bag at my opponent when I use my GX attack. <laughs> Fun. <laughs> stream can't end without chapter 6. Nah, Nebby, I think I'll read it next time, bro. I've been reading them, I, I try to read them like every other stream, for the most part. And like, I'm super tired, Nebs. <laughs> I don't have like the patience today for some memes. I don't have the patience for it. He got the Matangs, which is frustrating. Whatever. We have Lysander, so we'll knock out one of these Matangs. <sighs> this is getting super duper annoying. Does he have a Metagross? I don't remember if those Matangs were a Metagross this game. Or they, oh, they were at Matank's last turn, I mean. I don't remember. He's just going to get out of there. That's fine. One, two, three, four, five. So I can knock out Matank's relatively easily. Put it here. Oh, there's Dark Pulse. Then uh, I, from there, we knock out the Beldum and the Lele for game, I think. Because we already knock out Lele. So we'll probably go for Beldum next turn and then Lele the following turn. I think that's the goal. Because he has Metagross now, but Metagross is not really a threat to me. Actually, now it is. Never mind. <laughs> I didn't see the choice fan. Now he gets Okos. Mm, that's problematic. With experience share on the board, I need another Dark Rider on the board, which I can do because I have the Ultra Ball for it. So I put another Dark Rider on the board. We target the Lele's. And uh, we go from there. He's going to end me, which sucks. I have to get another Dark Rider on the board, and I have to attach an energy to it, though. That's how I'm going to win this game. We target a Lele, because we're going to have the same number of energies on the board. But we also need a Choice Band as well. We need so much, and it's not working. <laughs> we have our Stadium, which is finally good. But we're only going to draw three off this end, so I might just try to Sycamore. And of course, there's my experience chase. My god, my, my opponents are getting so extremely lucky. Oh, it's so frustrating, man. It's so frustrating. Oh my god, I'm losing my shit today, guys. I'm really going insane. Okay, so now I can't knock out Lele's or Metagrosses or anything. He can only attack once now, though. Like, he can't attack this thing next turn, which is, I guess, good. <sighs> Alright, let's go ahead and get Sycamore. Someone asked me how I'd beat, how I'd beat in Metagross. Alright, right, but there's so many memes in Chapter 6 with Lee now. Well, that's good, at least. Um... That was annoying to fight against in Sun Moon game, guaranteed a lack of offensive. Well played? What do you mean well played? You don't win yet. Relax. So you guys know about the new Lolan? I love the new Lolan Dino. I can't wait to keep playing that deck. Alright, this is good. There's a chance here. I don't have oh I still don't have another dark I was talking about getting another dark right now, but I didn't really have a choice there. There's Landy's. Do I hold on to one? Because I might attach it. I might use it on Dark Rain next turn. <clears throat> the Dark Pulse. 140. We can actually Lysander this Metagross out if I can pull it off next turn as well. This gets me Dark Ride down if he does knock me out. Of course he has everything though, because why wouldn't he? I bet you has a Metal Energy in his hand for attachment as well. Because you know, why wouldn't he? God, I hate, I hate when there's. I hate playing Pokemon, guys. Yep, there we go. So he gets a knockout. He gets a knockout on Darkrai. Can't really do too much about it. Now I have to hope he can't do anything next turn either. Like that's the only way. That's the only way I can win this is I have to knock out two Darkrai somehow. Oh boy! Oh boy! Oh boy! Oh boy! Oh boy! And of course he has Max Potion. I'm not playing Pokemon anymore today, guys. You know what, I'll play one more game, but this is so incredibly frustrating. Like, I just want to punch something. 
<laughs> I shouldn't be this mad, but it's been a long week. Like, I've been having some really bad family issues. Like, really, really bad family issues, which is why I haven't streamed in the past three days. And, like, I haven't been home, and I'm tired. And things are just, like, not going well, <laughs> mentally. So I'm, like, getting really mad today. I shouldn't be, but whatever. That's just Pokemon. Now that you put the quarters in the square jar, I heard you that heard that curse. That's fair. <laughs> or you owe Patrick 25 cents. Okay. <laughs> I can't play a different deck after this match. Sorry, I already started playing. Uh, my bad. Or do you plan on doing a banned card and expanded video? Um, probably not. I'm not that kind of YouTuber. Not to mention, like, I don't want to talk about expanded because I'm not the most experienced in expanded. Like, if it was standard, I'd definitely talk about it. But just because, like, I don't want to, like, if, if I'm not experienced in something, I don't want to, like, give people, like, false information. Because I pride myself on being able to give really good information on YouTube. Why do we always lead Lele? Like, what's going on? Mm, Pokemon, Pokemon, Pokemon. There are four Dark Rides in the deck, and you've led Lele four turns, four games in a row. Logic, right? Two Lele's, four Dark Rides. Three Evel Talls, but we'll just lead Lele every game. <sighs> mm. Can you go? You're wasting my time. I'm about to get mega triggered, bro. Of course. Of course. Um. Well, we got all three dark rays. It's kind of dope, actually. But we're stuck for the following turn, so that's not dope. Uh, okay. Okay. All right, relax a little bit, guys. It's all good now. I'm okay now. Hopefully he plays end. That'd be pretty nice. Oh, he played the stadium down, so now I don't have to worry about never drawing them like I constantly do. Play the end, please. That'd be dope. Thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. All right, cool. So we have a chance this game. We got to get some max elixirs, some manual attachments, some choice bands. All right, we got all those things I just said. We even have a Lele to play a Sycamore with, which is pretty nice. He's going to O-Wing. If I can get charged up enough this turn... Oh, of course, the thing as well. Uh, we're probably going to owing ourselves, actually, just because he's owinging. And it sucks that we have to owing second, but whatever. You get some really good advice. I'm wondering what kind of competitive experience you have. I've been playing Pokemon since Ancient Origins. So whatever, whatever... Well, I've been playing competitively since Ancient Origins. So whatever year, whatever date Ancient Origins has been playing, I've been playing competitively since then. And I've been doing YouTube with TCG for over a year now competitively. So I have a lot of experience playing. I've been, I've been to a bunch of different tournaments. And I've had a lot of success at tournaments. Um, I haven't gone, I've, I've went to regionals once, but like just because of like money and driving, I haven't been able to go to too many big events as of late. But next year I'm gonna be attempting to go, go to Worlds, so that's pretty nice. I just wanna put those in the discard pile. And we will play Sycamore here. Hopefully get a couple more max elixirs. And from there, we'll start O-winging. But that's my that's how long I've been playing, as far as Pokemon goes. And I've been going to League almost every day, so I have a lot of IRL experience playing and testing. We didn't really get anything that was that great there. Where do you manually attach for the turn? That was actually really bad. We missed all of our max elixirs. Ugh, that's not great. We get the first O-wing off, so that's kind of handy. Uh, we have Lysander, I guess. We only have four energies on the board, though, which is not great. Our energy GX is trash in 120 in Para. Yeah, GX attack is not good because Paralysis is just not good GX attack anymore. He's an NS, which is actually fine because I would love to get some Max Elixirs and Sycamores and stuff and just really just power through the deck. When you come back, when you've done 10. Yeah, I'm not. <laughs> Trust me, I'm not like a veteran of Pokemon. But I've been playing hardcore competitively for a long time, long enough to where I feel like I'm, I can say that I can say that I'm a great player. I, I, that's what I think. Cause like, once you've played, once you've played for that long, you should be fine. He's not knocking me out. He's only doing 80. Yeah, we're fine. We're okay. That's actually a really bad play on his part. Cause now he's not charging up as much. While I'm continuously charging up. 
We have to play Sycamore here, which is not great. But that puts energies for Owings. And then we put him in range of being knocked out as well. We have more choice bands, more experience shares. Ultra Ball. We already have two energies down there, right? Yeah, so we should be okay. It's so Owing. Put it onto this Dark Ray. We have Lysander now. We have a lot of options right now. So we're, we're in a good position. He can knock us out. That puts an energy somewhere. It makes it a seven prize game for him. And then we just start taking big knockouts from there. So I think we win this game. Oh, but he did that, but Beaskins, we just Lysander. Probably one of these with experience share, so it's not as big of a deal anymore. And he doesn't get a knockout. Like, he only hits for 30, so we can actually preserve this as well. But he keeps getting max luxuries. I have to I have to knock out one of these with experience share, unfortunately. He did make the smart play and put it on the other one. Hello, fellow boys. Luxurious. Hey, Luxurious Shockwave. Nice to see you. <clears throat> We're just trying to make some money today. We keep playing the mirror match for today for some reason. Yeah, we get to keep this alive so we can sack it later. Or owing suicide owing later. And we get our knockout this turn as well. So we get the first knockout. We still have plenty of... Um, What's it called? Plenty of energies on the before board. We have all of our experience shares. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. That's enough for a knockout. Who do we knock out? I mean, it doesn't really matter which one we knock out, but I want to knock out one of the experience share. So we Dark Pulse. Now he gets one less energy. He gets to keep one less energy on the board whenever we take knockouts. Um, and we get the first knockout as well. We have two, three Dark Rise set up, which means we actually win this game. Just like in theory, we win this game. Unless we somehow whiff a knockout. Which is possible, because I'm pretty bad at life. <laughs> it's got me a shiny Rotom and named it Yum 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 Yum. I don't know why, though. I mean, that's a good name. That's a good name. I hope we get a Rotom, decks with all the for a, Rot a Rotom deck with all the forms, and I can play all the Rotom item cards, and then I can just call the deck Yum 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 Yum. That's the goal in life now. Somebody make that happen. I need a Rotom Wash, Rotom Fan, Rotom Heat, and Rotom Fridge. I guess, is that what it's called? Rotom Fridge? I don't know what that... Rotom Ice? I don't know what that form is called, actually. <laughs> Hey Kyle, welcome back. Attack, 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 and that should be game, I think. Especially if we get Lysander every turn. Oh, that made things a little bit awkward. But we still get the knockout, I think. And he gets our knockout. And we get a return knockout because we have two experience shares. Alright, cool. We get our own knockout. We lock in here, we put energies with, with the stadium. Actually, Veltal is just nice to have down here as well. Put energy on that. Because we don't need to draw this turn. I would like to... I mean, no, both my lilies are down. I can't lay anymore. I right, will. We'll just Dark Pulse. That works. And he may get to keep an energy card, but we ultimately win. Because he actually doesn't even have... Oh, no, he does have Dark Eye set up. But that should be game. I don't see how he wins this. Can he knock out two Dark Rays at once? He has to go into Eve Veltal. Like, he can't just lit a Dark Ray out here. He's using a Lysander stall, but he can't because he put down the stadium and everything has an energy, so everything has free retreat. So that's game. Rotom, Fan Rotom, Frost. It's Frost, that's what it is. They're from Supreme Victories. All items are Rotoms and attackers are Rotoms, pretty much, bro. That'd be fun. I would love a Rotom deck. I, I I never played a format where there were Rotom cards, Rotom Pokemon, that like the, the f different forms, not the, like, the there's base one cards I played with. By the way, guys, thank you guys all so much for coming to the stream today. We've been streaming for two and a, over two and a half hours, almost two hours and forty five minutes. So go ahead and drop a like on the stream if you have not already. It's always greatly appreciated. That's not gonna save them, right? One, it's still two, four, five, six, seven, eight. Yeah, we still get a knockout. Like he has to retreat this turn. He has to attack with this one, to be honest, I think. And that gives him a chance. But we still have choice ban, so I think we still get knockout. I, still, I think we still get game, yeah. I know you need 50 coins, but come back tomorrow. I don't want to. I'm having fun. You, you guys get a longer stream. Like what? <laughs> the more I suffer, the longer the stream gets to be, right? That's what you guys want. He didn't even knock us out there, so that's just game. See how, how hard we can hit no, we whiffed. Oh, yeah. Okay, cool. So we finally won a game. That's 10 coins, right? So that makes things a little bit easier. I don't actually know how many coins we need, to be honest. I think it's 865. 
I want to just get a win streak so I can get this. <laughs> I think we get another 10 coins with the next one as well. No, Orbaum can stream as long as he wants. Just like the stream. Hey, appreciate it, man. Plus, it's been because you guys donated like over $80 today. I want to give back. <laughs> That's wild. And it's funny, like I don't I don't want Pat to donate or anything like that, but it's funny that we got all this all these donations and none of them are from Pat. Hey, we finally leveled the Voltal, finally. On the turn we're going second too, that's actually not bad at all. If I can just top deck a Pokemon, this would be perfect. I'd manually attach, top deck a Pokemon, use Max Lipster on it, put down the stadium and Sycamore. That'd be a perfect turn. We're playing this Nine Tails deck again. Hey, yeah, Orbum, can we battle? Probably not today. Gengar sightings, what's up Gengar? Nice to see you. Thank you for joining up to the stream. It's always greatly appreciated. Ah. Let's see what they can do. Oh, Pat Dunning, three dollars. Three dollars for a three-hour stream. Can you please play a different deck? I don't know what I would play that's like worth me playing right now. Because like this is the best deck for fast games. Every other game is gonna take forever. <laughs> like at least with a deck that I feel like can win. I guess I could play Mega Ray, but I hate playing Mega Ray. Nine Tails is takes too long. Gardevoir also could take too long. There's a lot of math involved. Pat the boy. I gotta give Pat his, uh, my boy Pat the stuff. He got another. So Pat now has 11, 3 plus 9 is 12. All right. He now has 12 entries. The boy Pat. There we go. Thank you so much, Pat. My boy, Pat the boy, Pat the god. That's the man. The man Pat. We can actually win this game <laughs> if we get a really good turn one. If I land two Max Luxers here, well, unfortunately we didn't get a Pokemon, so one Max Luxer is not going to be landed. Do this. Be sick more. So what we need is a Dark Rai and two Max Luxers. Let's get it. <laughs> nope. But we can O-Wing this turn, which is handy. We just O-Wing now. And he gets to top deck whatever he wants, which is not great for me. But like, we have a good lead, so I'll take it. So how have you been? I've been alright. How you been doing, Richard? It's nice to see you. It's been a long time. You should play Greninja or Expanded Excel Gore. Oh, I could play Expanded, but Expanded is lame. I don't like Expanded. Greninja is good, but I don't know how fast Greninja is. Greninja is kind of like a long setup kind of game. That's why I always play Darkrai when I want like a fast game, because it's a turbo deck for a reason. Get tomorrow today when it's 12 midnight. Your boys, Pizza Joe, poor, only 38 coins in one event ticket. Can't do that 800 coin challenge. Ah, uh, it's uh, Lupe. I'm in, I'm in the same boat as you, bro. I'm just sitting here trying to grind for coins, and I'm doing so poorly today. Oh, he got rid of my choice. I'm just fine. I play four, so I'm not a big deal. Still on top. <laughs> That's the boy pet. As long as I basically am a Pukamuku. That's funny. Today's donators are wild. Like and Rock right? is good. Pukamuku. P U K U M U K U P U K U M U K U. It's P U. It's not P U. It's P U. P U K U M U K U. We can sick him more this turn. Because once again, I want to just get my big knockout. I want another Pokemon too that I have an O Wing target for. I can wait for Dragon EX if you guys can convince Aura to play Waylord. I'm not playing it today. I'll play it tomorrow though. Once again, guys, like I have a goal today, so I'm just gonna stick to that goal. We have. All streaming like for the rest of the week. We'll be all right. No worries. I've been doing well and I've been busy with the Omega series. So yeah. Oh yeah. How's that going? I hope that's going well for you. Let's get down a. Do I get down another Darkrai or an Evolta? Because I want something to put my experience share on, but I want to put choice bands on Darkrai. I think I put down another Evolta. I think that's what I do. We'll give it experience share. <clears throat> we manually attach for the turn. And we Sycamore. We can get another Dark Ride down and some Max Lixers. That'd be really nice. Come on. All right, we kind of got it. One, two. I can't attack with Dark Ride yet as much as I want to. Let's do... I'm probably going to end next turn. Uh, but I don't want to lose too many energies. We'll do this. I'll put the Lycan off my discard pile as well. What do I have down here? I have two ends. That's fine. I won't play the stadium yet. Because I don't need to yet. A little O-wing here. 
I'm trying to put it in range right now. One, two, three, four, five energies next turn. Five is what? 120 damage. That's not enough for a knockout yet. But if I got a choice band, I think that'd be enough. Could be 150. Yeah, that'd be enough. So I need to get a choice band next turn. If I can get the choice band, can you say Alo Momolo? Alo Momolo. Alo Mo Mola. It's not that hard. It's just Alo. So A L O. Alo Mo. Again. Alo Mo. And then another Mo. And then La. Alo Momola. That's the girl, Alo Momola. See if they're going to knock out this turn. Biro Ahai, Nico, Izawa. That's really fast deck. Cool. I don't have top of the if you're willing to trade. Uh, do I'm doing a top related giveaway right now, or it's a what's it called? A raffle? As that's what somebody told me to call it. I kind of agree with them. For every dollar you donate to the channel through Super Chat or just PayPal, you get an entry in the raffle. It's all on my Twitch. It's all on my Discord. I mean, so it's pretty handy as well. <sighs> Named it Faint Attack, so it better be a shiny embryo. <laughs> nice. What happens when you grow up, you grow up in the Minecraft chat? Oh, he's just gonna knock out my Dark Ray. That's a smart play. It gets rid of an and two. You no, know, it gets rid of no energies on the board. So that's actually, I don't know how I feel about that play. <clears throat> Boom. Boom. Doesn't really accomplish him much. Because I could still win this turn. As long as everything goes well. Because I have my stadium this turn for sure. Uh, I can end. Ending, ending would get me a potential... A potential choice ban. That is... Oh, that meant to, Obviously I put it over there to be a stadium. Luckily we got the stadium off that. Oh, that was so lucky that we got the stadium off that. I'm so mad though. I almost messed up. One, two, three, four, five. No choice band still. I shouldn't even play that stadium yet. Oh man. One, two, three, four, five, six, sixty, one, twenty. One, four, so yeah. One, two, three, four, five, six, sixty, one, twenty, one, forty. One, forty is ten short from a knockout. Shouldn't have played that stadium down. It's whatever, I guess. It's okay. We get a knockout next one. They need to put down another Pokemon or they lose. I love Momola, tell Darium that, that's what I'm saying. The man cannot say Alomo Momola. Should try to say Draw Nine Tails is pretty good. It is pretty good, but once again, it's a slow deck. Like, like I play, I, I've played, like, any deck under the sun. What happened here? Hey, Gengar Sightings joined the Aura Army. Thank you for joining the Aura Army. It's always greatly appreciated. Um, but yeah, I put any deck that you imagine that is good, just Google it on my, just go Aura Bomb deck name, right? Aura Bomb Pokemon, and then you'll probably find the deck on the channel. Because I've played a lot of channel. I've played a lot of de decks. Let's see. I want to see the exact number. Because I actually have a number of just standard videos I played. I go to over here. <clears throat> I am currently on for PTCGO. 158 battles. 158 games done with just my new thumbnail. That I guess is not new ish, but like since I've gotten since I've gotten the updated thumbnail. Okay, experience share. Once again, he has to GX attack this turn, right? He doesn't though. He knocks me out, which means I win. He can't win now, because I just attach and that's game. That was really bad. I don't know why you would do that. 2, 4, 6. 7 is 140. Right? 7 is 140. Well, that's just game. 2, 4, 6. That's just game, right? Like, I'm not missing up here. It's 120, Yeah, that's just game. I really hope I'm not missing up here. Okay, cool. That's out of the way. That was the most inconsistent Ninetales deck I've ever seen. I wonder if I can look at his deck list. No, I can't. 37, all right, okay, we're getting closer, guys. All right, so even get past the two win streak, finally, for the night. Oh, let's open up these, because they could give me coins as well. Actually, let's just open up all of, let's just take a little mental break and open up all of our lock stuff that we have. So we'll go to collection. Gotta go, guys. Or make sure to send me a trade you give generations, maybe both on our gifts. Alright, sounds good, bro. The trade to draw nine tails. Math it, bro. Oh, these are Ala Illuminati confirmed that is true. This need to describe how to say Alomomola is weird. Alomomola? What's wrong with Alomomola? I think Alomomola is a great name. I love the name Alomomola to be a man. Oh god, or I made a total of $91 today. That's good. Dude, if I can just make eight eight more dollars, bro. Eight more dollars confirmed, maybe? Uh, let's see. I know there's two sentiment packs. Let's open up these two. See if we can get something good out of this. I think we're going to do a break if you have any extra. Unfortunately, I do not have any extra. I'm sorry. 
Darian also counts Mountain of the Kila Mat Kilimanjaro. Oh, I haven't seen that yet. That seems pretty funny. A little Kramitable. This is not the good one. The fighting type one is a pretty good one. That's been fun to play. I like how they made like reprints of all these Pokemon already. I have to put in the rest of my uh, codes that I got today from pre-release. Man, we, I never pull anything good out of lockbacks, bro. Yeah, I have 25 packs here. I don't have enough, unfortunately. I want to get more, and I have my boxes coming in. So once I open those, I'll be able to... Uh, I'll be able to... What's it called? Um, what, is, what is it called? I'll be able to put in those codes in. So I'll have plenty of codes, but like I'm not going to get those right away, which is unfortunate. Which means I'm probably going to have to like mooch off of sticks if he lets me. Get a locked Ultra Ball. That'd be the worst if I got a locked Ultra Ball. So I'm like 10 short now, which is really upsetting. <laughs> Can I get 10? Dang it. I'm so close. I'm like 5 short from getting the Xerneas. I got nothing good there. That's fine. Um, let me take a look. I want to see how, how, many, how much there's left to get that Xerneas thing. Because I don't have it yet, and I want it. It is, I'm literally eight coins short. If I can just get another 10 coins, please, that'd be nice. We got locked to make Altaria before, <laughs> rip. We print some Pokemon, but still haven't made Alolan Executor GX. That's what I'm saying, or like, Alo or like Alolan Marowak, which is something I really wanted to see. Cause you know, why make a set called Burning Shadows and not make Alolan Marowak in it? Like that makes sense at all. Like what? Or like an Alolan Raichu GX. They have like the one bad one that's in a different set. Oh look. Can somebody please, at the end of the stream, tell me how often I've led Lele in this deck? That'd be pretty dope. Uh, am I going first? I am. This hand is not great for going first. I guess I could play teammates this turn, but I don't have an energy attachment and it's nice to have it. So I really want to play like a draw supporter. Oh, that sucks so much. I want to play second war this turn. Let me just go ahead and play second war this turn. Yeah, whatever. Please don't be prized. Thank you. I got freaked out for a second. But one of these one of these people are holding choice band. <laughs> we'll give it to the benched one, I think. Get sick more here. We're playing against fighting, so so much for our win streak, right? We have a chance of winning, I guess, if we if we set up really nicely. And also Lele attacking by itself has a pretty good chance of winning as well. Print some Pokemon, but some, yeah. I'll be patient as long as Executor is really good, pretty much. Um, it's gonna be hard. No, wait a minute. I can attack it with Lele. I want to keep. We can get rid of the Stadium card in our hand. And yeah, we don't have any draw support for next turn, which is not great. Let's grab Darkrai. I was, uh, maybe grabbing Evolta would have been better, but you know, it's not, not the biggest deal in the world. I'll do that. What does Xerneas offer last for? I'm not too sure. That's why I want to get it right away. Can't wait for my Burning Shadows pre-release. Tell me about it, bro. What are you hoping to pull? I pulled a lot of stuff that was good, but nothing I want multiple copies of. Like, I want to get multiple copies of Ace Rola, Guzma, Choice Band, um, and Super Scoop Up, right? Oh, and Fairy Energy. I actually want to have 10 secret for energy. Um, but I only got... I only got... Uh, I mean, I got good stuff. I got a secret rare Lycanroc. For hyper rare Lycanroc. I got secret rare fire energy. The one energy I want the least, but I needed it for the master set. I got full art Gardevoir and Salazzle. So I got a lot of cards out of the way that I wanted. Which is good. Oh, he's playing Lycanroc. That's so bad for me. That's so extremely bad for me. That's so awful. Hold up, I have to knock out this Rockruff. I can't let him have Rockruffs on the bent, on the field, but I can't knock it out this turn. Oh, that's so bad for me. And I don't want to end either. Oh, that's so extremely bad for me. I have to end. Oh, that sucks. I I, oh, I didn't want to I didn't want to ruin my win streak. Oh, this is so bad for me. Okay, well, what card does he get rid of? Can I play down to the widow? I don't know. Lele, that's fine. Oh 
man. Lycanroc is so scary for me. I have to knock it out before it becomes a Lycanroc and starts abusing me. That's really bad. 9 out of 10, Lele says Hoopa is bad, Shaman is the worst, I'm the best. Pretty much. Sassy Lele. <laughs> I need those. Oh yeah, I need Guzma, Acerola, Choice Band, Super Scoop Ups, Fairy Energy. That's the. Th oh, a Hyper Rare Gardevoir and Glitz Spot is wanted but not necessary. I want three of each, but I don't need to get those. Like, I'm okay if I don't get those. But my goal is to get um, three Guzmas, three Acerolas, three Choice Bands, and four Super Scoop Ups. And then. 10 fairy that's like the back burner yeah there's the like so now here comes problems this is this is huge this is such a problem for me oh god he's gonna gx attack me now oh, i'm sad i am sad i get when this game I have to rely on lele things are looking bad for your hero boys especially since he can just oh actually claw slash doesn't knock me out never mind We got Max Luxor, which is handy. Do I do that? I think I do. I think I just... Yeah, I'm good. I can do this. Uh, so, oh, I don't have any more Lele's in the deck, so I actually... This doesn't do anything for me. Um, sure. I can Lysander this next turn. If need be. Maybe Weavile Honcho can see some play, at least a Rogue. I mean... You're better off playing Honcho Tapu Koko, to be honest, because Weavod depends on energies. Although it's still good, don't get me wrong. OMG, those sleeves are amazing. I like those Pyro sleeves, yeah. Bro, how long does Xerneas offer last for? I don't know. I, I would tell you, but I honestly don't know. I need this Lycanroc gone. Um, he has this. Which means he hits for 150 now. That's a scary number. But I have Darkrai that can attack, and he has no other Pokemon charged up. So that's actually really, really good for me. And I can just charge up a Lele in the back as well. His Carving Break, which is very frustrating. But as long as I have Lele's in the back that can attack, I should be okay. I think. I can have a Suicide Attacker. There's Floodstones. Instruct again. Do any sleeves last until August 8th? That's... Oh, that's so long. I can do it in time. But that is still... I still... I don't want it. I want to get them soon. Um, I have to retreat. Actually, he can't. Can you knock me out with this? 20 damage. He needs to get a strong energy to knock me out with this. Should I risk it? Is that worth the risk? Is that worth the risk? Let me play this. I don't know what's in my deck that I could grab, but I don't think there is anything. Yeah. I don't know if that's worth the risk. Because then he's getting more. I don't want him to get prizes. So then I just attack with uh, the l experience shared Lele. I don't want to attack with Darkrai because I don't have my stadium. So I think I attack with this, unfortunately. I mean, we get our prizes. And we can still potentially win this game with just Lele's alone, I guess. But it's still frustrating. There's, a There's apparently three Lysanders. Okay, I mean, three Lysanders is not bad. I can kind of control what stays in the active. Uh, I can put the Zygarde out there as well. With the Regirock, Rock, which is terrifying. He does have the strong energy, so I'm glad I made the right play there. He doesn't get a knockout, which is good. One, two, three. He has Fuel Blower. That's frustrating, but that's fine. Like, I don't really need the... Because that's in the active now. It doesn't matter. It's probably going to be the one that gets knocked out. Uh, he's going to charge up Zygarde, which is not what I want to see. But at the very least, I can get the first hit off on it. If I make six more dollars, I'll give away a Seismitoad EX, a Mega, Mega Charizard, regular from Evolutions, a Mega Blasters, Charizard EX, and a Secret Switch. Nebby, relax. You don't have to do all that. I appreciate it, but it's unnecessary, man. Like, I really, really do appreciate it. Don't get me wrong. Um, so much, though. This Zygarde has 190 HP. I can't hit those numbers on my own, unfortunately. He's gonna charge up a couple Lele's. He'll get a knockout. I get a return knockout. He knocks me out with this. That's game. So I can't win this game, huh? 
I'm trying to see what I could do to win this game, and I'm just not seeing it. Oh, I can, I can send out a Regirock and just stall for a little bit, and hope you can't do anything about it. Take my play. Stall for a little bit, because I can't do anything else. <coughs> I mean, he already put down like three floatstones, so I'm hoping that he has no more left. Yeah, those three floatstones are gone. So if he has no switching cards like Olympia or uh, Escape Rope, he does have an Olympia. He hasn't, I haven't seen any BS Seeker yet. He might be playing a post rotation build because that's what it's looking like so far. Um, like it just looks like post rotation, so he might just be having fun playing post rotation, which is a definite possibility. So I'm going to rely on that being a thing. I think it's just stronger if I attach it. Actually, no. I want to attach the Lele. I have to attach the Lele. I don't have a choice. I keep not getting the cards I want. Maybe I should attach the Lele in the back. Lycanroc is deadly. Lycanroc is a good card. I like. Oh, he does play Seeker. Oh, never mind. Well, there's the Olympia, so I, that's game. I can't win this game. Yeah, there's no way I can win that game. I literally just cannot win that game. Uh, it's so frustrating. Why did I have to fight fighting? Like, and then, like the complete counter deck. And that, like, I could have, I could beat like Pissimian because Lele's are good against Pissimian, but like, that's the complete counter deck, man. That's frustrating. Okay, I literally, I only need eight more cents. <laughs> Come on. It's a W and that's my prediction. Nope. You were wrong. Okay, look, non non Lele leads. That's already a good sign. Because leading Lele in this deck is atrocious, apparently. Because every time you do like you need that Lele for support. Alright, we're fighting Dark Red. So now we have a good chance. Now we have a decent chance. All you need to do is get another coin. Why are some cards trade locked? If you buy, if you if you get them by the card gifting you the packs, or you buying them using your coins, they are locked. You cannot use those cards. Yeah, turn one, Bridget. All right, so how am I gonna win this game? I don't wanna play too many items, but once again, like the items don't worry, don't worry me too much. Maybe I should play belt in this deck instead of uh, instead of uh, choice bands. I, I, I like that idea kind of, but like it just makes the deck a lot less offensive. Now right, we got at least a dark energy this turn, that's handy. But yeah, I don't like playing in, but whatever. Uh, max looks just handy. Means we can attack next turn at the very least. <clears throat> Either card. And we just pass and hope for the best. We can Sycamore next turn. We have the Stadium. I can bet you tomorrow, Uh Maybe, we'll see. My viewer battles are usually on the weekends, like Friday through Sunday. And today I've been trying to do the Xerneas thingy, so that's why I'm like not too sure. We'll see, we'll see. For sure, we'll see. Uh, that Garbodor is going to be kind of a problem because of Lele, but I think we'll survive. I might get some viewer matches tomorrow. By the way, guys, go ahead and drop a like on the stream if you haven't already. It's always greatly appreciated. What sleeves are you using? I'm just using... Oh, these are sleeves. I always buy sleeves in the Mart, because once the sleeves in the Mart are like the rarest things you can buy, because they're actually super useful. Ultra Ball, it's pretty good. Pretty good top deck. We do this, we grab a new Belt Hall. And I could also grab a Soto Widow. Kind of bend him down a bit. I like Soto Widow instead. And uh, rid of another Pokemon. Lele, Lele is whatever. Once again, we have plenty of attack targets. I don't mind doing that at all. I just want to limit his bench. Another Darkrai, more Dark Energies. Not necessarily what I wanted to see, but it's better than nothing. And please don't disconnect on me. I'm trying to stream here. Thank you. You got a knockout here. I'll take it. So, it was one knockout. 
Garbodors don't hit me too hard. Evo uh, Drampa. Drampa could knock me out, but he can't set it up in one turn unless he also plays Max Luxor. There's only two two items down there, so once again, the Garbodors are not too much of a threat. We have Eveltal, we have Sycamore, we have Dark Energies. We're in a good position. Possible four hour stream. I mean, it's possible, depending on how long this takes, man. Like, I need eight more coins. If I get eight more coins, then. I, I missed the roulette wheel. At least with the roulette wheel, you got coins a lot. Now I'm just kind of, you know what I mean? He'll play teammates. What's he going to give teammates? What's so useful that he needs teammates? I'm also dying with thirst. I know my voice is going to hurt a lot tomorrow. Ugh. And it's already, it's only midnight. All right, that's not too bad. Um, I still got to do my card organization. I mean, I could save it for tomorrow, but I don't want to. I want to spend tomorrow morning, like, recording. I want to record post-rotation decks in our current rotation just for fun. I want to see how that would work. So let's see. I want to see how much we got today thanks to all you lovely people. So as far as donations go, we have 86 donations, 86.5 uh, 86 donations and dollars in donations and two dollars in super chat. So we're 88 dollars and 50 cents which means we need 11 dollars and 50 cents and that would be a full 100 dollars in one day that's kind of wild to me you turned off abilities which is whatever you belt all energy oh yeah the stadium down do this we don't get a knockout unless we land a bunch of max luxers here but that's fine we already have three down so i think i just grab another you belt all and we Sycamore. There's another Max Luxor. Only one, unfortunately. Put this on a Dark Ray. One, two, three, four, five. That's a knockout, right? Is that a knockout? 120. Is that 160? One, two, three, four, five. It's 100. 120. 120. That's 150. Yeah, we're two. We're trying to short. All right, let's go into Evelto. I'm just trying to feel a little bit. I want to knock out Drampa, so I think I'm just gonna, that's the goal I'm shooting for next turn. I think we'll just, I think we'll charge up that Jack, right? I might as well. If you get Forest Team, I'll set, I'll set water on fire. I'll set a water on fire. <laughs> I love that. If I, if I could trade you coins, I'd give you all 69 then. No, I'm serious. I actually have 69 something this time. That's funny. <laughs> uh, I appreciate, appreciate the sentiment. Unfortunately, you can't do that. I always thought that it'd be cool that if you could sell your locked packs for coins in this game. I don't know why they don't let you do that. Or your locked cards. It just seems like a convenient way to make more coins. Cause like that seems so natural you think, right? I don't get it personally, but whatever. I'm not the Pokemon company. Check my trades, I'll check my trades later. I got you big diggity dog. All right, so next turn we knock out Drampa. Drampa's a threat, so we have to make sure we knock out all the Drampas. Um, Got two set up things with no experience shares on the bench, which is annoying. Two, four, six. Yeah, that's a drop, that's a drop on knockout. Now we just start knocking things out, right? For game. Boom. There's, a, there's my experience share and another max lixer as well, which is good. Just starts to keep the keep energies on the board. Okay, whew. I can t I can tell the energy is starting to like chill out now, which is good. We have 21 people left. Oh, it's okay though. We got 43 likes. That's amazing, guys. Thank you guys all so much. You're in my choice bands, but I still have one, <laughs> so it's like whatever. I can still knock out this and this for game, or like this and anything else for game. As long as he doesn't end here, I'm in a good position. Because then like all I have to do is Lysander. How many items are down here, by the way? Two, four. Six, that's not even enough for anything close to a knockout right now. Please don't have N. I know, I'm pretty sure he has N. Which is fine if he plays N, but it's like, whatever. This means I have to waste a couple turns. Oh, he's gonna play teammates against Oh, that's great for me. So I just Lysander this, get a knockout. And um, I just get one more knockout after that and I win the game. Good, 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 good. And the chat just died. <laughs> Straight up. Oh, we got 44 likes. Shout outs to you guys. Truly, truly the greatest viewers and subscribers of all times. Of all times. 
<laughs> every single times. <laughs> <clears throat> Richard, what's up Richard? What's the question marks for? You got problems? So this is not knock me out. And we have trash lanch. We have experience shares, which is good. Um, we have another Lysander. Experience share on Pseudo Widow. Energy on Evoltol. Max Elixir. On Pseudo Widow, just in case. Lysander U. And we retreat into this. And we get our knockout. Boom, bam. And then we win the game next turn. We have three Dark Riders ready to attack. He has no way of getting rid of all my energies to like prevent me from knocking him out next turn. Hello, hello, hello. I want to play. There's a lot of hellos that just happened. Hello to all of you. <laughs> I want to play Modern Madden, but no point in playing 17 when 18 comes out soon. I guess that's true. Don't let the chat die. <laughs> you guys are funny. I don't know why he's still playing. I'm just gonna give him well played. Like, I don't know what he's doing. He has no way to stop me from winning. There we go. Coins? Coins? Yeah, coins? Was that coins? Yes, we got it. Guys, we did it. Oh, okay. I never want to play Pokemon again, except for 24 hours from now. Actually, it's more like 20 hours from now. Um, actually, probably less because I have to record. All right, collection. Give me this. That's not what I wanted. I'm so tired that I don't know what I'm doing anymore. Okay. Chat will never die when Lord Neppy is here. Give me this. Sam chat so we don't die trying to be, don't, not, not trying to be rude. <laughs> you guys are funny. All right. Okay, we got packs open. We got boxes. We got sleeves. We got a Xerneas promo I have it. I don't have. Okay. Okay, let's open up these packs. Whew. Whew. Keep the stream going even more, bro. I am tired. How about this? How about this? How about this? No, I'm not doing it. Never mind. <laughs> For all the donations we got today, guys, that's unrealistic. I am gonna do one one day, but today is not the day. Today is not the day for that. No way. <laughs> all right, let's see. Anything locked besides breakthrough? Um, does not look like it. Okay, let's open up these. Give me something amazing. Guys, I need you to understand that I am dying. I want to stream for four hours, but that's an extra 45 minutes that I don't have time for. Because I got to I gotta do stuff tomorrow. Hey, we got a reverse. Oh, hold up. We got a full Mega Glalie. All right, that's good. I'll take it. That gives us two. That's pretty nice. I'll take that. It's pretty nice to have. Okay, one more. I go to my trades. I got to go to my trades. Apparently, people want me to go to my trades. Um, and somebody wanted me to put Eveltal or like Steam. I don't know what they wanted me to put for trade. Hey, why does the reverse look so weird? I mean, it's cool. I have two of those now. What did I have to put for trade to, uh, for, um, for Heliolix? I have all of my, I have all of my packs for trade. Oh, I have one not, pack not for trade. What pack is that? Yeah, all my packs for trade, and he was giving me a um, what's it called, a Voltol. So I don't know why he couldn't do that. Cause he said he wanted Steam Siege packs, but my stuff wasn't unlocked or something like that. I don't know. Mega Glalie hype. It, in the end, it was all worth it. Nope, it was not worth all that stress. <laughs> but we'll pretend like it was, right? Orbom is getting this for what? I appreciate it, bro. <laughs> Thank you. I have four of these now, which is actually really nice. Two Mega Blasters, if I ever want to build Mega Blasters again for some reason. I've actually battled the guy with the Mega Blasters deck, and he lost horribly. Okay, thank you so much, man. I appreciate it. All the two cannons and the Caterpies. <laughs> All the meme mods. Generations booster boxes. Oh, is that what he wanted? Oh, I don't have any Generations. No, I do have Generations. They're there. They're all there. I don't know what he what he's looking for. Gotta wake up. That's what I'm saying, man. I gotta wake up soon. Everything's here. Although, I don't know if I'm gonna give away generations. I have to give away something like Steam Ages. I have all these things I only have so much of. I don't wanna give away. Let me see. Do I have generations? I should have plenty of generations, though. Yeah, I have 20 generations. Yeah, he can take generations. That's fine. Well, regardless. Whew. 
Thank you guys so much for watching today. Drop a liggity liggity like if you can. That'd be greatly appreciated. Uh, tomorrow, I did not have time. I forgot. Don't have time to edit um, generations or pre-release tonight, which means I have to edit it tonight, tomorrow, and upload it the day after. So tomorrow, there's going to be a battle of Gardevoir versus Galissapod IRL. So be on the lookout for that. If you guys have not already, and if you guys do like uh, supporting the channel, for those of you that want to go the extra mile to support the channel, the today's video did not, like the today's MLPB, the Major League Pack Battle video, like apparently didn't get a lot of likes. I think there was something wrong with the system or something, because I've seen a lot of people comment, but there were barely any likes there. So um, if you guys want to go check out the video, maybe drop a like on your way, as well as any of my other previous videos these past couple days, that'd be greatly appreciated. Of course, you don't have to if you don't want to, because it's, you know, it's kind of annoying and inconvenient, but if you get the chance, that'd be greatly appreciated. Um, let me know. Uh, in the comments of videos, in the chat, whatever you want to do, what decks you want to see me play in the future, because I will be playing checked on stream and like live deck matches I'll be doing until we get these cards online. So let me know what decks you want to see me play. Um, I think that's it. <sighs> Exhaustion just hit me. So drop a like, subscribe, share all that good jazz, and I will see you guys next time. Peace.